Uh, we're waiting for the update to hit, so uh, we're not doing anything right now. I am streaming, but I always have you guys uh, muted on stream. We're making a Skyforge, that's it. No, we haven't had the update either, so... Oh, yeah. I don't think uh, the server is open yet. I mean, it should be open, but, you know. Okay, it builds out, apparently. All right, let's see. Yeah, we're getting an update. Update is coming. And... Yeah, uh, yeah. All right, there we go. Uh, are we getting a capture? Remnant. All right, I'm. I think I'm spawning right now, boys. Yep, middle one, right? Yep. I updated just now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I've forgotten tree is here as well. Test, test, test. Test, test. I can hear you, uh, tree. Yeah, yeah, I can hear you too. Memorush rush the enemy settlement. No, uh, we have a settlement test. Uh, they, they changed the, uh... Wait, was that... Was that Iron Duke that said that? Okay. Ah, okay, yeah. Uh, Lee Bob, I think it's, uh, yeah, going to take, uh... A year, maybe even more than that. Uh, just start something. Uh, hold, uh, hold mic. Just start the uh, the thing. So yeah, I'd say it's definitely. Uh, I mean. I mean, it really depends on how they do things, but, uh... 
Uh, you kind of have to, you have to have, uh, no, okay, that's not true. You don't have to have a large group, but it really, really helps. Because doing is alone is not impossible, but you need so much to do. That you're not going to be able to do it uh, alone. Hello, Mr. H20. Uh, I don't read Russian, unfortunately. So uh, I don't know if Commandant Play is uh, playing today. Uh, he plays Anvil and is Russian, so and streams on YouTube, as far as I know. Okay, I started a workbench, but I don't have enough uh, sticks to even finish the workbench. This is annoying. Uh, I'm a trucking. Hello. Um. Yeah, it's, there is a lot of, uh, like I have stuff, but not the right stuff. I need twigs. Branches. I don't think I'll get them. It's, the, I, the, I don't like the mad dash in the beginning. Uh, Like when the, the there were less players, it was kind of okay. Because... Because the, uh, the Mad Dash was kind of okay, but uh, it isn't anymore. So it's too much scrambling for, well, in a sense, scrambling for positions. I hope that changes. I assume that will change later on, but... Uh... I'm not sure if that's actually. I went there, I tried to put down a uh, workbench, but I didn't have enough sticks, branches. So. Wait, you are at the, uh, okay. Uh, yeah, that would be nice, yeah. Um, yeah, I'll just keep moving around. Uh, I don't find any branches anymore. I'll come to one of our towns uh, if we have one, and I'll drop what I have. Because I got a bunch of uh, grain. Wheat. Yeah, I just have to wait till they uh, respawn. Uh, basically go so. Oh. We go basically we go south. Um.
Yeah, they made it so that it automatically spawns. Come to think of it, it would be nice if we didn't spawn in uh, very close to nighttime. Uh, crap. I can't really... Okay, there's a bear. So we'll go around. Oh, okay, there's a road. Oh, bear. Should be around here. Uh, wait. Oh, I need to go north now. Wait, for what? For the gathering pit? Wait, it was 15 last test, I think. Was it 10? I remember 15 as well, yeah. I don't even know what I put into the tutorial thing. Yeah, but that's because you're drinking. I have a lot of things, but no twigs. I'm so sad. I still have four so winches. Okay, good. Save it for the campfire. We definitely need it. Yeah. The gathering pit still needs 12. All right, uh, we'll just wait. Uh, like I have uh, quite a bit of stuff on me, but I can't really put it somewhere now. Oh, okay, we already have it. Okay, good. Let's go. Yeah, there is a bear in the... <laughs> Can we trap it in our... Uh... <laughs> that would be cool. No, we can't. Damn it. We need three more twigs. I don't mind, call it whatever. Wait, we're the wood chopping town, right? No, we're the aqueduct one. So anything that's water related would be okay, I guess. Oh. Mm, maybe. Oh, mist keep sounds good. Yeah, we, we're the keepers of the mist. Sure, we'll do that. We'll both, whatever you want. Both work. If somebody needs uh, has twigs, we need a campfire. Although it seems uh, that the hunger isn't going that fast, honestly. Mist cave. Oh wait, I don't know. I don't know where you are. Uh, claim so, before we forget right so 
Does not accept. Why? Why not? Why not? My okay. I don't know. Let's cook a bit while we're here. Okay, that's good. I just need more uh, branches so I can make an extra Try to build huts right next to each other as best as you can. This is gonna be a hut area, essentially. Got a meal for the lumberjack? Oh, you all eat it. Wait, a food is in the gathering pit. Alright. Oh, wait, you, you heard that, right? Yeah, okay, good. Yeah, yeah I hope it. Freak. Don't worry. Yeah, I get a... Like, I, I need to remember when I talk in-game, when I'm talking in Discord, and when I'm talking on stream. Alright, uh... I don't know who the berries have. Alright, we need to build up the lumber in. camp. Beauty is coming, guys. Beauty is coming. Uh, can I put... Hey. No, I can't put it in here. Hello? That would be so much better. Uh, I don't know. No, this is the issue with the mad dash at the beginning. Everybody's gathering twigs and flint, so... Everybody has, like, three. Which is not helpful. No idea. Uh, by the way, if it sounds like I'm uh, responding to things, I'm generally responding to uh, Discord. Ha, nerd. What up? Uh, it's uh, hot, mostly. That's... That's... The biggest issue. Uh, okay, the cabbage is taken. Uh, so yeah, right now uh, we're very low on branches. Everybody, uh, we started a town. It's a settlement test, by the way. Uh, just to uh, reiterate this, uh, people uh, know. Uh, they changed it from PvP to uh, settlement because they added. Uh, let's see. No, okay, so this is the bellows, the anvil, the assembly station, barreling, quenching, trip hammer, and the forge. Uh, that was in the last settlement test, but we now have woodworking, which is a saw buck, a lumber camp, and a powered sawmill. So a powered sawmill also uses, uh... Okay, I'm going to do something stupid, but it doesn't really matter at the moment. There we go. So yeah, they added uh, the soul buck and the family patch or whatever it's called. Let me see what it's called. Uh, where is it? Power connection rope. No, that's power. All right. Uh, no, that's the wheel. I don't know where it is. It's like a family plot, uh, which basically is your clan. So you can uh, sort of claim it for your clan. I'm looking. I don't know where it is in which category. Name a kid after you. We can do that. Uh, unfortunately, we can't get have kids right now in uh, Anvil. I don't think that will ever happen, though, to be completely honest. 
Otherwise, I would, but uh, I can't. I asked him. So. So, it's the first it, it, first iteration of the soul book, right? It's why we're testing things. Uh, our city on the map, uh, Miskeep is over here. I'm here. So uh, this is the entire map. Uh, this is our main city. We're making a mountain town. This is the town that should make the uh, uh, water thing. Uh, aqueduct, basically. And since we were short on basically everything, I just went out to explore. So I'm going back to uh, the town right now. Okay, I'm coming to Mistkeep now. Yeah, just localized production and then... The entire map, right? Good. All right, let's uh, try to... I, I'm always very wary, especially during the night. It's uh, And in between trees, it's so hard to see if there's anything. Uh, no, some mountains are definitely passable. Uh, you can spam climb as well. So it's, you're not necessarily hemmed in by mountains. It, uh, it helps or, well, it helps to seclude you. Uh, but yeah, there's, there's definitely, uh, mountains that you can climb up. Uh, wait, there's a bear. So, oh, uh, I want to be very careful. All right, I come bearing gifts, boys. Uh, let's make a... Oh, I... Okay, now... Nah, okay, uh, I need to note this down. It would be good, uh, but that might be abused. But it would be good if a public production uh, would have, like, an, an extra queue as well. Like, there is no uh, public... Uh, plant down a resource oh. container and put all the flints in there. Like, because the production queue is full... There isn't really again. any, uh... Yeah. <clears throat> and it's all personal, right? These are all logged, like so uh, I'm trying yeah, to do uh, open ones. That's why I'm ones. here. I understand why people do uh, uh, private ones, because they want to build their houses, so... Mm-hmm. Oh, sorry, 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 sorry. What's up, man? Uh, if we don't move, it doesn't see us. Oh. 
<laughs> Shit, I'm falling. I'm falling off. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Ooh. Yikes. I think most people are taking uh, twigs to make houses so they can pledge. I made a bunch of uh, public ones. I still have more on me, so I'll make more public ones. Miss Gip. Can someone be a dedicated cook? Yeah. How can I drop items to the ground? Alt click, alt click. Press tab to open you. your uh, inventory and then alt click. Thank you. All right, let's wait till this is done. No, 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 don't put berries. Don't put berries in this one. Don't put, don't put berries in this one. It's a, uh, it's, <laughs> it's one of those things. You get paranoid about everything, right? We now get paranoid about food. Uh, oh, okay, hold mic is already. Uh, I think we need, like, a, a slum area where people can have, like, yeah, where they can have huts. Like, that would be good. Like, oh. Oh. oh, no. Mr. Oh, nice. You survived. Uh, Axeman, there is food in the town hall. I don't have a pig. Well, who? What? No, this is OG. Come on. No, 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 no. Okay, let's put the uh, berry preserves in here. Hey, someone put this in there. I'll gather more. I'm gonna die, actually. Uh, hold on, I think I can make more twigs. Yep. Oh, okay. Hi, Splints. Uh... All right, uh, currently I'm just cooking uh, so that we have uh, food everywhere. Uh, just keeping everything filled. Once we have enough food, I'll be... That's almost done. This one is nearly done. Uh, 
Uh, also, I'm assuming the lumber camp will get removed. That was a great yippee. It was one of the best ones. I wouldn't be surprised if lumber camps get removed at all. Get, all right, let's uh, eat way. and I'll go out oh. to uh, to get some more stuff oh. going. All right. Uh, I'll go out to... I don't know. That fucking dumb I'll it. just put in twigs. There we go. All right. There we go. We go north. Uh, I just want to explore now, see what I'll... Uh, what I can find, try to not die if I can. And, uh, we'll go from there. But yeah, uh, it, it's, it, it's the harshest, the hard lesson I think we all learned, uh, over the previous test. Uh, you can definitely do a solo town, not an issue, but you're not going to do, uh, like a massive town with everything. Uh, you need a lot of things are locked basically behind, uh, not necessarily behind tech, uh, in a sense. Like you need stone. Uh, stone is available without mines, but not in large quantities. So if you, if you really want to like upgrade to tier three, you need uh, like this will give you one stone piece. That will give you one stone piece. So definitely not enough. So you'll need more than that. So the best bet, uh, even though if people don't like it, I'd say it would still be, uh, depending on how things like end up, right? But is to start uh, in a larger town. And if you want to start a smaller town, maybe the way to go is to start in a large city slash town, uh, make stuff like tools and things and use that to establish your own thing and don't start from scratch but like start with better stuff maybe that is the way to go I, i'm i'm not sure i need more coffee i'll be getting some coffee in a bit i don't think yeah i think i'm at uh yeah we're at there okay Let's let's punch the chicken. All right. Uh, I mean, uh, what was my idea? Yeah, yeah. So we go here. Uh, let's just keep going to straight to the uh, what is it? West, west. Yeah.
All right, more six, good. I think, is that silver? Uh, oh crap, there's a... Oh, bear, 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 bear. That's silver, right? I think that's silver. Uh, that's silver? Iron ore, okay. I found an iron ore mine, uh, if anybody's interested. I'll mark it on the map, hold on. It's the fortified position marker that is north of Iron Bridge. Iron mine. Oh, sorry. Yeah. I mean, at this point, I might even be better off starting a new town, right? If this is entirely empty. If I can find more uh, branches, like, look, okay, so there is a workbench. I don't know if a person is there. But otherwise, I might be able. Okay, let's just be careful. All right, what did I say? I needed coffee, yeah. Okay, let's be careful here and I'll go get coffee. I'll be back in a... I mean, I kind of want, if I can, to start a town around here so we can uh, utilize the iron mine. Which could be a, a good idea. But uh, yeah, right now I need to be careful. And try to see... Okay, I need... I have seven. I need at least... Uh, we need 15, so I need eight other branches, right? Yeah. I know there is a wolf there. Somewhere. Yeah, there's wolves. Okay. Wait. Oh, it's a banner. Hold on. No, that's a settlement. Ah, family area marker. Can only be used by designated family members. For each highly experimental, may contain severe books or side effects. Require tier two settlement. Okay. I really love, by the way, that they're uh, upping their uh, game with explaining things in the drop downs already. Like with Foxhole, they waited a very long time. Yes. Uh, no. That's eight. Yeah, see, okay, so this is this is one of those things. I think uh, if you do... Wait, if I can do a saw buck, that might be the way to go. Hold on. It might be more uh, efficient to build a... Wait, what, what's the saw buck? 
No, that's 26. No, 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 it's not. I was thinking maybe it's uh, worth it to build a soul book, uh, and once you have the workbench, uh, just make axes and then uh, make your sticks for your town hall, but it, that's not that's not the thing. All right, uh, so I'll be, if I can, and I don't, if I'm not too stupid, so that's nine. Okay, let's let's grab enough so I can uh, force uh, get myself in. Okay, so uh, what am I hearing? Okay, okay, let's let's be. Okay, there's the bears. So I need to move in between here somehow. There should be. Okay, so if I do this and we make a tunnel here, like we do just this, there we go. Now, all I need to find is uh, the workbench. There was a workbench around here somewhere, but I forgot where exactly. Uh, wait, that should be marked on my map, isn't it? No, it isn't. Uh, okay, workbench. Workbench is 10. I'm all done. They learned a lot from Foxhole, which will make this game a lot better. And to be honest, I like this time period medieval. Yeah, it's, uh, yeah, they said definitely, uh, with Foxhole, damn, finally going for, uh, like having explanations on things and having drop downs that, uh, do a better job and having, uh, uh, well, just more information in general. I'm, I'm very happy with. But yeah, it's definitely, I think, in their favor that they uh, already are making fox holes. So even though it's not the exact same um, dev team, like there is different developers uh, involved in... Uh, it's the same company, but it's not all the same. All right. All right, just one more twig and... All right, all I want for now is to finish this. Uh, there we go. And then we name it. Uh, cancel. That's not good, by the way. Uh, New Remnant Town, Mist Keep, New Remnant Town, Crow Castle. I mean, it's basically Iron, so it should be an Iron name. But it's going to be like the Ironwood. Yeah, there we go. Confirm. It's probably, yeah, 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 yeah. Probably Ironwood 2. Yeah, Ironwood 2. I was afraid of that, but, uh, you know, can't have everything. Uh, I, I just put, I just started a new town, Ironwood 2, that is like basically on top of the iron mine. On the north. Ironwood 2, it's uh, in the north of the map, all the way in the north of the map. Destroy the uh, fortified position next to that marker is where I started Ironwood 2, yeah. Wait, why do you not... Are you zoomed out in? Just zoom out all the way. Yeah, it's it's north of Iron Bridge. Pretty 
but yeah i'll try to uh, at least uh, get some stuff going there so that we uh, can use the yeah i'm i'm getting my house done and get some i have a workshop and then i'll uh, let you guys know Uh, one of the reasons that houses can't be easily destroyed is to prevent easily griefing people you don't like by just repeatedly killing their house. It's it's a delicate thing, right? I mean, I do agree. There should be possibilities to... Uh, branches is such an issue. Like, even here, I'm, like, not entirely alone, but basically alone. And even here, it's hard to get branches. Also, things are heating up considerably. Uh, Lee Bob, that is, uh, yeah, the planning was to go colonial in War 105. Yes, sir. If that actually works out right now, like, it's it's very hot weather around here. Uh, I'm not a big fan. Hello, Ibram. Hi, hi. Is it okay for me to build here? Uh, yeah, if you want to uh, start a house, you can uh, pledge to this town, yeah, sure. Oh, thank you, kind sir. I can, I can build two. Oh, you can build two, that's good. Uh, hold on, I'll place... Oh, uh, wait, I'll place the blueprints and... you. Ah, okay, them? okay. Uh, make sure that you pledge to the town, uh, hero. I don't know what that means. Uh, so open the house. So you stand next to the hut and you press E and then you click the flag icon in the actions panel. The little flag icon. Yeah, now you're pledged to this town. That ah, you thank can you do very stuff much. In this town. Yeah, there you go. Uh, be careful. There are uh, bears to the south over there. I see, I see. Okay, so what we need now is to st start some uh, food production and some plank production as well, probably. Okay, I have a axe. Um, let me think. Uh, if you press B, you can see in the build menu in the category that is almost all the way to the right. Uh, the one that looks like an axe in a in a stump. Do you see that one? In that category, there is a saw buck. If you can place, let me hold on. If we build this, uh, we can put uh, logs on that and make it into uh, planks. So that's a way to do that. But we need more planks for that. Okay. Oh, so, yes. And we need a fire pit so we can make food. Why can't I store any of this? This is so annoying. Uh, well, we'll search for more wood. Uh, I'm going to uh, try to find some uh, branches so we can have more twigs. Yes. Yeah, do the same. Yes, the on the front. Sorry, uh, Lee Bob. Yeah. Uh... I might have to get an ice pack in front of my fan just to get the temperature down inside my case. It's okay. It's at 85 degrees, which is, I mean, definitely within range for a AMD CPU, but not necessarily a big fan of very high temperatures. 
but why, where is my... Yeah, Brent. The branches, branches are the issue right now. Like the dependence on branches Okay, branches, branches, come on. This is always. I remember the first uh, free pre alpha test. There were not that many people, so there was like room and there was. Um... Like, and there were, like, branches were uh, relatively common. Right now, they're definitely not common, like, at all. I see branches there, but that's, like, in the middle of bear territory. Which is not good. Like, I only need three. So, that's the good thing. So, I can make a fire pit. So, if I'm careful and don't go into combat mode, and I can sneak here. Sort of. Let's call it sneaking. We'll make a fire pit. There we go. I'm just happy that the fire pit doesn't require flint as well. <laughs> that would have been horrible. All right. Uh, we do that, and we do that. Uh, I'll be back in uh, half a minute. Uh, food should be ready right about now. There we go. Uh, we wait there. Oh, I... Okay, let's uh, fix this by doing that. So I can eat and I have uh, food for uh, the other guy as well. Hebram. I mean, he might have died from hunger already. Hello, love. Uh, Lev, can you hear me? T to talk, if you have a microphone. Yeah, there is no emotes, buddy. I don't think so. Okay. There we go. We get that in and we put that in there. Uh, why, 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 why does it not do this? Uh, let's cook a bit, uh, and then I'll go find more. I guess. Uh... I think he died, the uh, Lev, to the bears.
No, oh, he's still alive. Okay, that's good. All right, uh, what do I need for torches? Uh, torches can't be made here. Wait, where do we make torches? Uh, no. 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 <laughs> That's water. No. Ah, blacks blacksmith? Is it a blacksmith? I think it's a blacksmith. Yeah. Oh, food. Uh, there's food in the town hall, uh, Hebron, if you need it. I've got some cabbage seeds and uh, some wood, like 29. Uh, you can put the cabbage seeds in the town hall, because otherwise you can't really store them anywhere else. Just right-click on them, that moves the entire stack at once. Uh, start preparing twigs. Nice. Uh, just make sure that you eat. Uh, keep an eye on your hunger bar and make sure that you're not uh, starving to death. Oh, I'm just dying. Okay. Alright. Um... I'll be uh I'll be out exploring a bit. Uh just feel free to finish the saw buck. If you finish the saw buck, you can uh chop down trees, uh, bring the logs on the saw buck and then use your axe to turn them into logs. Basically. Okay. But if you want to do something else, that's fine as well. Like don't let me tell you what. No, no, the, everything is fine. Let's get a small roasted. There we go. Okay. Uh, let's see if I can find more. If I go that way, I haven't... Yeah, okay. So we go there. I haven't really uh, tested that. Check that. Okay, let's, let's have a look here. All right, uh, what do we need for the... The blacksmith, so I need 15 planks, yeah. Oh, this is where I was earlier, and it's stuck. Okay, yeah, 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 we can... I can go there. It's fine. Let's just climb here. Uh, I need to be careful here. I don't think I'm going to find anything. Yeah, no, wait, what? I get so confused with maps for some reason. It's very weird. Yeah, so this is space. Yeah, 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 yeah. There we go. That's where I needed to go. Oh, good. All 
All right. Uh, while we get our stuff, yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's just have that process. Let's. Yeah. Uh, let me put down the volume on Discord. There we go. There we go. That's better. I mean, I can drop that. Alright, that should be hopefully the saw buck or at least close to it. So uh I don't have to go there, we just go the opposite way basically. Uh let's cook some bits while I'm here. So this is one of the issues, well, uh, one of the cooking issues. If you put um meat and berries in, it will always do the berries first. So you have to, if you want to like cook meat, you have to take out all the berries. So it has a uh, priority order for your recipes, which is kind of fine, but it's it's also uh, annoying at times. We'll get there. There we go. So I can't show you, but I think we saw that earlier, right? When I was uh, doing the uh, back in the other time. Like I, I, I'm, I'm still not sure how I feel about the cooking. Like I, I kind of like that it is um, slow and not easy, and it requires effort, and you can't just like oh, dump a shitload of uh, stuff in your fire pit and be done. On the other hand, if you're like doing things with a small group of people, it, it it's kind of annoying. So I'm I'm on the fence. On the, this is one of those things. Uh, I don't. I know that happens a lot to me in games. Like being on one side of the coin, it's always great, and being on the other side, you're like, yeah, this kind of sucks. So, for instance, uh, yeah, uh, in Foxhole, there's a lot of things that I don't necessarily mind or even kind of like uh, being on the dealing end. But on the receiving end, I fucking hate it. So I don't mind artillery that much unless I'm on the receiving end and then I hate artillery. <laughs> But okay, maybe don't mind is not the correct term. It's more like I don't care. Because I don't know. Like, that's, you know, that's 300 meters away. I don't know. All right. Uh, I'm going to. Yeah, I'm going the right way. Yeah. So all I need is the blacksmith station so I can make torches and once we have torches we can torch the uh bear then Uh, Diamondback, it can be very peaceful uh, until we run into wildlife or if we... Okay, right now we don't have a PvP test, but uh, in PvP test, it's uh, mayhem. Or at least can be mayhem. Ooh, nice. Nice work, Hebrew. Ah, Lev is here as well. Good. Did Lev set his... Uh... Did he pledge to the town? He did, right? Yeah, he did. Yeah, good, 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 good. Uh, so we grab that. We grab those. Put that in. Grab that. We'll have to... Uh... 
let's just wait for a bit uh what i need what did i say blacksmith uh if we uh when we have planks uh we can make a blacksmith and if we can make a blacksmith we can make torches and with torches we can torch down the bear den to the south so that's gone i see Okay, so we'll wait for this. Uh, I'll drink some coffee. Uh, so yeah, right now it is very peaceful. Yes. It will be less peaceful. Later. Okay, that's eight. What do we need for a hammer? Three planks, two flint. Wait, do I need... Hold on. Do I need a hammer for the... And a hammer. Yeah. I was afraid of that. Okay. Got that going. That's an axe. That's good, but I need to hammer right now. Okay, uh, can I put the feathers in? I can't even put the feathers in. I, uh, like, okay, that's that. No. Hammer, and then we grab those. There we go. I mean, we need more planks, but yeah. And I need to be careful with my food. One more plank. Uh, axe, equip, grab. Eat. There we go. Oh, wow. Oof, that took quite a lot. Ah, okay. So, okay, yeah. That was, uh, so that switched places. I have to look that back. It's at, uh, 119. Plus 119, uh, log, trade, place, plank. There we go. Torches. Uh, 10 twigs, 3. Okay. Ah. So 10, 10 twigs, and 3 fiber to make 10 torches. That's going to be interesting. I'm putting fibers in chest. Okay, good. Yeah, I have uh, generally enough. Yeah, I have enough fibers on me. Uh, make sure to put the uh, seeds you get from chopping trees in the town hall so we can replant the trees later. Oh, yeah, I'm already replanting them. Oh, you're already? Okay, I, I, I didn't say anything then. If I could commend you, I would. I can't commend you, but, you know, wrong game, but otherwise I would. <laughs> no, that's not the fox call. Yeah. 
is mine. Okay, can I store the feathers? Okay, we'll we'll store the hammer. There we go. All right. Uh, branches. Let's go find some branches. But why do we have a? We don't need this. Yes. There we go. I'm sorry, left, but uh, we don't need that. Not enough resources. Wait, what am I missing? Oh, uh, there we go. I need ten. That's it. Bear traps. You need iron, I think, right? That's 16. Is might not be enough, so we might need to... Uh... Wait, what? Oh, you can switch. Ah, okay. Uh, just make them only into planks, not into twigs. Uh, generally, it's better to okay. just... It, generally, it's better to just search for branches and turn those into twigs and use the logs to turn them into planks. I see. Inventory full? Yeah, I know. Damn it. There we go. There we go. Okay, let's be careful here. Do you know what will be the defining feature of each faction, or is that going to be cosmetic? Uh, knowing the devs and seeing that in uh, Foxhole they introduced asymmetry. Um... I don't think it's gonna stay by purely cosmetic, honestly. Let's be careful so I don't get a, an angry bear on my ass. Ah, there is an angry bear. Uh, yeah, I mean, if we can, if I can kill the, oh, fuck, he died. Uh, if I can kill the bear then, that would be so helpful. Please tell me that's 10. Okay, that's 10. That's another uh, batch of... Uh... But yeah, yeah, no, it's. I, I don't think it's going to be cosmetic. I think it will be. But I, I mean, this is pre-alpha, right? Like, sincerely, um, it looks pretty good. Like, you know, some people might say, hey, this could be going into early access, but it's, it's pre-alpha, right? Day 123 where you didn't get an alpha test invasion. Uh, ah, I'm sorry, man. I'm sorry. That sucks. I'm doing good, uh, Jeremy Kurt. I, well, I, I say good. I'm, I'm, I'm melting. Literally. Well, not literally, but, uh, I'm smelting. It's hot. Uh, I'm keeping an eye on my CPU, which is kind of okay. For now. I fear that it will be throttled soon. Uh, uh, Lev, can you hear me? Wait, Hebron, can Lev hear us or is he uh, not talking? I don't hear anything.
Uh, you want to throw some torches at the uh, bear then? Just grab five torches out of the town hall. They go in your left hand, so you press two to equip the torches. Right uh, mouse button to aim and left to throw. So the first one is the iron mine, it's the one behind. Careful, the, don't don't get eaten by the bear, 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 bear. Huh, I thought we would have had it by now, but we need more. Careful, there's still a bear. Uh, let's get some food. And don't forget your hunger bar. Uh, that's eight. Okay, so two more twigs, branches, whatever. Yeah, that would be good. Uh, but how are you doing? Uh, sorry, uh, Jeremy. Like I said, I'm, I'm smelting. I, I'm not good with heat. Uh, if it's hot for longer, like an extended period of time, I will get used to it eventually. But usually by the time I'm sort of used to it and my body kind of adapted and started, uh, you know, dealing with the heat a bit better, uh, is the time that the heat wave generally is over and it suddenly is like... 18 degrees again, so. Uh, but other than that, it's fine. Uh, guys, how many torches do you need for a uh, bear then to kill it? 21, okay, good, thank you. Yeah, more than two barrels, okay, yeah. Thank you. Just finishing testing out facilities in Foxhall. Ah, it's still um, uh, b -b 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 resistance phase, right? Yeah. It resistance phase together with um, Death Branch is an excellent time to test out facilities, especially Death Branch because Death Branch gives you uh, magic boxes. But yeah, but the resistance phase is fine as well because people aren't bitching about, ooh, what about the, uh, the sub-region modifier, yada, 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 yada. Right? That's good. Resistance phase also eating tasty bread. Tasty bread is always good. I mean, it's in the name, kind of, but... Uh... But yeah, um... Like, self-made bread? Like, I very occasionally make my own bread, but that's, like, once a year. <laughs> I don't think that's, uh... Should be calling it that. Really. Honestly. Just to be sure, I'll take two. And they said 21. I asked in, uh... Wait, that's not enough? Okay, it's not 21. Or are we just... Am I aiming wrong? I mean, that's a possibility, right? Like... Uh, it's also the... Fission is weird. Come on! Well, it's not 21 for a bear, then, I can tell you that. Mm -hmm. I chuck 28 right now, and it's still not down. I mean, maybe I'm not a good, as good a thrower as you are. That's a possibility, obviously. Pan de sol. No, I don't. No, I don't know Filipino bread. No, I'm sorry. 
Is that like I I mean is that like a, a flatbread? It's a round bread. Okay. Yeah, I took the one log and brought it back. Still looking for branches. So branches and berry. Berry bushes would be good as well because we need a fiber uh, and I'll eventually need flint as well. Mm -hmm. Am I going to play? Yes. Uh, the plan is to play in 105 as Colonial. Uh, that's the plan. But like I said, it's very hot. I don't like hot weather. Uh, so I might change my mind. But yes, for now, it's basically the plan. Yeah. Or at least uh, I'm not even sure if it is uh, going to be Colonials. I promised Kraut that I would play with him, and I'm pretty sure. I mean, he's basically a Colonial uh, loyalist. So, yeah. Ten. Yeah, that's good. All right. All right. So more torches. Uh, where am I? Yeah, there we go. Straight north. Uh, be careful though, because there might be all kinds of wildlife around here. <sighs> Like, you can hear the bears. Uh, there is a weird audio thing where if you're in the vicinity, in a sense, you can hear the bear even before you can see it. Ah, there it is. Okay, so I have to go around, yeah. Uh, on the Wardens, uh, depending on if you play in a clan or, uh, like, if you play solo or in small groups, it doesn't really matter which uh, side you're playing. Honestly. Hello, Fekotov. Can you hear me? Yes, my town. Yeah. Well, our town. Uh, you want to join? No, it's not a. Well, it was it, it was about to be a PvP test, but they um, changed the uh, test to a settlement test. Uh, because they added um, the sawbuck. Uh, let me see here. Uh, this one. So you can put logs in here and then use an axe and chop the logs into planks, which is faster than uh, with the uh, lumber camp. Uh, foods, foodies, 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 foodies. 
Uh, the next test, no, because this is the last in the uh, tests that were announced, right? I think. Am I am I correct? Or is there one at Should the end? Should we build the diamond mine still? It's like twenty planks. Wait, sorry. Uh, yeah, you can make the. Uh, you need a hammer. Uh, I have a hammer in my house. I can take it and drop it for you, so you can build it. Hold on. Oh, hold on, I'll drop it here. Ah! Bear, bear. <laughs> Why is the bear then not dying? Come on. Okay, I finally killed the bear then. Uh, be careful, but uh, for now we won't get any new bears. How are we gonna kill a bear? Uh, bears can be killed with uh, spears or with uh, bows and arrows. Uh, maybe I can even use a torch. I don't think so, but let me try. But can we at least go into the mon the rocks or something and hide? Uh, so, uh, where the bear den was, there is a bunch of leather that dropped, but there should be weapons there as well. So be careful. Wait, 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 be careful. Drum! Ah! No. You haven't seen the game yet, hype. Uh it's uh I I really do uh like it personally. Uh why can't like I hate that I can't put like the thick letter. Like the, the storage rules are so annoying. So it is uh, pre-alpha. So um, there is a. Uh, it, it's all. Uh, there is a lot of work in progress. Uh, things aren't necessarily uh, fully fledged. Yeah, no, it's it's uh actually pretty pretty good for a uh, pre-alpha, but things are very much in flux, so they will keep changing for quite a while. What's with all the letter? Like, I don't need all the letter. I need I need a weapon. Watch out! Watch out for the bear. There we go. That's where the inventory is, and the inventory should have the weapons. And now there is a fucking bear there. Come on, to charge with your cavalry group in this game. I mean, uh, yeah, there is. I mean, there is cavalry. So there we go. Okay, let's uh, scoot him off. There we go. I don't know. You didn't know there would be PvE like bears? Yeah, no. So there is, uh, there are wolves, there are bears, there are boars, uh, chickens, but they don't attack you. Gentlemen. Hello. Careful. Bear, 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 bear. Imperial, run. Go on the road. Go on the road. Go on the road. 
I dropped the letter. Well, how much to uh, cheese? High damage. Medium damage. Okay, let's go with the sword then. I love uh, I love the animals. Uh let's just kill it. Uh, to use folks of cities with my video, I want to say thanks. A uh, great detail. You're welcome. Uh, I think some of the facilities are slightly out of date, right? The videos. I mean, it's it's good enough. I mean, it, it teaches you the basics, so you know how to go around stuff. If I'm not mistaken. Uh, no, I don't. I don't. Personally, I wouldn't like AI uh, bandits or anything like that. Like, uh, wildlife is fine. Are you kidding me, game? Come on! Oh, man. Big Sag. Not go more by bearer. Like, I couldn't hit it because it was up and it, uh, man. Pre alpha. Look, it says there pre alpha. It's fine. Uh, so yeah, Zombo. So, uh, but that's personal, right? Like some people might think that that would be cool. I think uh, knowing the devs, uh, they probably want to at least stick to the principle that if you see a human character, uh, human characters are meant to be um, players. Is is what I'm assuming. Uh, if we want, we can store the uh, iron in a uh, resource stockpile. Let's make sure I'll make one. An extra one. Yeah. And that leather? Uh, the leather can go into uh, storage boxes. Uh, is I think the only thing that will accept it for now. Uh, and otherwise we need animal processing. But uh, yeah, just do the uh, iron first. That's fine. Put that in the resource uh, stockpile. I mean, I need to get my uh, to my dead body as well, but for now, uh, there we go. Let's go, remnants. Let's go. Uh, so sorry, uh, Axel Fowley. Um, right now, the sign up for pre alpha is closed again. Before every the weekend before tests, uh, they open up the uh, sign up for pre alpha. In that period, you can just go to their Steam page and say apply for uh, pre alpha. And uh, once you've done that, you're in the pool that they use to um, draw from for um, people to participate. Uh, I'll put one closer to the uh, iron mine. Hold on. So uh, when uh, when they open it up, I generally throw a uh, community statement, a community post uh, on YouTube so that people know. You enjoyed the Foxhole is Dead? Uh, some people found it too clickbaity. I kind of agree. But I mean, that's the world we live in, right? If you want people to watch your shit, <laughs> you need to be clickbaity. I can't help it. There's nothing much I can do there. Uh, let's do a, a storage chest. Uh, that was the point. 
there, there's just too often and too many people are saying, oh, the game is dying. Uh, I mean, literally, I've, I've seen that. I've been in Foxhole since 2017. Basically, uh, since it released on Steam, like a week later, I had it. Uh, and since that time, like I was doing the research and going through the Reddit posts and the... Uh, and the Discord posts and the uh, Steam posts, and it's literally it goes down, it goes back to 2017. Hello, Colin. Oh. You need any help with anything? No, just just walking around, looking at cities. Okay. Just uh, be sure if you have questions, just ask them in uh, either in voice chat or in uh, normal chat. Most people are uh, happy to help you and answer your questions. I've seen, I've seen one or two deer in total. I think. Oh, excuse me. should be around here right uh by the way we got uh iron ore production is up right now so we're making iron ore right now if you need it where did i die i died here right ah this is where i died yeah that's all i need They won't forget Foxhole. Uh, so there is a separate dev team. For, okay, there is some overlap, but uh, there are separate developers for Anvil as opposed to Foxhole. So Foxhole will still, and they have uh, still um, plans for Foxhole. They still have updates planned. At least that's what they say. I mean, I can't, you know, I, I don't necessarily know, but... Uh, the chest is full. That's what they say. This is like Age of Empires Village or Sim. Yeah. So, uh, well, I mean, like Foxhole is an RTS where you're a soldier. This is uh, Age of Empires RTS where you're a soldier. Definitely. Yeah. Yeah. So my estimation is that Anvil will have overlap with Foxhole for people that would like to play it, but it's definitely not a one-on-one. -on -one. So not everybody that likes Foxhole will like Anvil. For a fact, I already know some people that have access to um, Anvil that are av avid Foxhole players that played Anvil and basically said, well, it's at least right now it's not for me. It's it's not what I like for um, from Foxhole that's not in Anvil right now. So I'm not sure what that is for them, but yeah, it's... Uh, like the actual frontline infantry fighters, armored fighters, I don't think they will find that much fun in Anvil. If that's like their biggest desire in Foxhole, that's not not going to work. Logi people definitely are going to like it. The engineering people probably are going to like this as well. People that like facilities uh, might like this as well. So yeah, it's, uh, yeah, we'll see. Probably won't play Anvil Early Access, rather play the fully developed Foxhole. Yeah, I mean, there's there's different ways of looking at this, right? Like, I, I like to play uh, Early Access, Pre-Alpha, or whatever the things are called. Uh, it depends, right? It's not every game calls it the same thing. This was stupid. Uh, I, I survived, but oof, that was despite my stupidity, you know? Because my stupidity. <laughs> uh, partisans rating is a thing, but rating works different. Oh, well, okay. So rating it, it doesn't work necessarily different in Anvil, but it is different. So if you just go raid with just a sword, that's not enough. Like you're not going to do much damage. On the other hand, if you kit yourself out, it takes quite a while and actual work to kit yourself out. It's not like it is in Foxhole. Like, you don't get kits by just, uh, you know, dumping a 200 BMATs into a factory and getting, like, uh, you know, a, a crate of a rifles and a crate of um, 
ammo. You, you need to do more, and especially with armor and stuff. If you go raid with your armor, which you definitely can do, uh, you, you die, and you basically give the enemy uh, access to your kit. So you kind of don't want to do that. Because, like, we are a very poor town, right? The, the town I have here. Uh, it's very poor. We don't have much. Uh, but it's ours. But if somebody were to raid us, they are away from their own spawn point. Uh, we die, but we can eventually will punch them to death. Once we punch them to death, that means we have access to their tools. Once we have their tools, uh, it's not going to be easy to raid again. So, yeah, you're... you're Giving the, like giving gear to the enemy now in Anvil is worse than giving gear to the enemy in Foxhole. Depending on the gear you give, obviously. Yeah. Definitely be a game of this century. I mean, it will be a pretty good game, at least the way it's looking right now. Uh, if it's going to be... Well, in, in Foxhole, loot has value as well. But it's like a small value, depending on what you loot. Like some things can be very helpful to have. Like if you can loot a, an enemy player, or an enemy logi as a colonial and you grab like a shipment of white ash grenades, that's going to be helpful if you like faction specific things it could be worth it. But, yeah. No, uh, so enemy uh, right now, I need to think. Like, we had tests where if you started to attack an enemy building, it started dropping silver. That's a long time ago. We don't have that anymore. But uh, people tended to care. Like, I loved frontline looting, but that was back in the day when uniforms weren't out. And when uniforms weren't out, you could... Uh, you could carry way more. These days, you can't really. So when I do frontline looting, it will be for, like, tripod weapons or stickies or HE grenades or anything that I deem uh, sort of has value, right? But yeah, in, in Anvil, that really, uh, like the last PvP test, uh, we wanted to fight, uh, we had a fight with the enemy near their gate. They put a gate down where they wanted to attack us. Uh, they won against us, which meant they basically had double the sets of armor they started with. So, yeah. It's, it's definitely something you need to uh, keep in mind. I really need to get rid of that uh, bear. But I, I, I fear that if I use... I, I'll break the Caligo sword, right? The Cal Caligan sword. Yeah. I'm going to... Uh, different cultures, different habits, I suppose. Yeah, this is what I was afraid of. Yeah. I mean, I keep sending it away, but I need to kill it. I just need it to kill. This is a uh, settlement test. They they changed it to settlement test. Because of the soul buck. Because of the soul buck and the family thing. <laughs> That's like me looking for my glasses when I have my glasses on. <laughs> oh, 
It's fucking hilarious. All right, uh, I have at least 12 iron ore if somebody wants to come get it in ironwood. Uh, we got that, we got that. Oh, I need a pickaxe. Let's see. Uh, what else? Okay, I need... Okay, he's he's doing that. That's fine. What we need is uh, some protection so we can start upgrading our town. And once we do that... The only issue is it's very hard to, like... Uh, oh, there we go. That works. But yeah, I really need to get rid of those uh, freaking uh, bears. So can I make spears? We can make spears. That's three twigs, three flint, and one fiber. Okay, I'll just go find more uh, branches then. I mean, this is not worth it. Not really. I mean, okay, the, the upside of doing this is this is automatic. And this, but this is faster. So I, I'm, uh, uh, yeah, so that's, that's for anybody. Uh, that basically goes for Foxhall. I never put, I don't really think I put that uh, enough out there in my uh, tutorials, but it's very, very important that one way or the other, at least you try to communicate and at least acknowledge that you understand other people like by whatever means whether that's using emotes whether that's using local chat whether it's i don't know like wiggling or crouching or whatever but uh because just like foxhole it I, i've talked about this earlier like people get paranoid because uh like things if you place it wrong uh, it has to be demolished because it will be in the way there's limited building space uh, yes you can extend the boundaries of your settlement but that cost planks uh you know so it's it's like people are a bit paranoid uh, even i am which i usually am not in foxhole but here i am uh so it's it's very important if you have any means of at least you know signaling okay i i i hear you or i read you or whatever uh that that's even if it's just to say that you don't understand english uh at least you know that's something better than nothing But yeah, seriously, that's uh, that's 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 important. But yeah, that goes uh, that goes for Anvil as well. Like I said, uh, it it's just yeah, because like it's like people getting upset because uh, for instance, uh, people upgrade houses to tier two when we don't need it, so that takes planks. Uh, but later you kind of want to upgrade them to tier two so you can demolish some of the old ones like uh there is a lot of things that can go wrong and it's just helpful if you know if you can say okay yeah yeah yeah, yeah, yeah sure i i understand you i hear you uh, i need to go north okay so we grab these branches and we'll uh we'll go north So I was, oh, that's a good point. Yes, uh, I was basically fencing in. The Germans built the Atlantic Wall. That was quite a big wall as well. I mean, they also built the Mauer. Oh, 
All right. Uh, hello. So I wanted spears so I can at least kill the dragon. No, not the dragon. Uh, not enough resources. What am I missing? Oh, twigs. Ah! <laughs> All right. Uh. All right. So we put that in and that in. And put this in here. I might need some food. Uh, so those. Okay. How many spears do I get from this? All right, let's uh, start a wall as well while I'm at it. Uh, wait, how is it obstructed? Okay, so uh, let's get my... Uh, I get one spear. Okay, fair enough. Uh, it's fine. Thank you. Where is that spear? Wait, are you telling me that the spear is stuck in the bear? Please don't tell me that. Uh, wait, wasn't it a left alt? Where it was? Uh, what was the button to highlight stuff on the ground? That was left alt, wasn't it? Oh, it doesn't seem to work. Oh, never mind, never mind. <laughs> no, I already picked up what I was searching for. <laughs> That's why it wasn't showing. No! Damn it! Where the hell? I don't see any spears. God damn it. There it is. Come on, die already. No, 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 no. How do you unpledge from a town? Uh, you can build a house in another town and uh, pledge there, and that should unpledge you. At least I hope I am unpledged in the other town. Uh, I might still be sort of pledged, semi pledged. That makes sense. Oh, wow. I can see the spears somehow. But there are the spears from like five minutes ago. Can you stay stuck there? It would be great. So that's a... Uh... Wait, well, who's... Uh, we, as soon as we build it, upgrade it to tier two, wolves will start coming to our town. So we need a uh, wall around. Oh. 
Come on, game. Come on. He's been stuck the entire fucking time. Ugh. Uh, did it help, Corsal? Answer your question. It's a Russian YouTuber. Uh, let's go. That's gonna be the... It's, the AI is so much better than it used to be. Like, they used to have a lot of this SPC. Like, a lot of the drifting and floating and uh, turning around and being stuck. You cannot bear to see the struggle. <laughs> Fair enough. Fair enough. Wait, it didn't work? Huh. That is interesting. That sounded horrible. <laughs> that sounded very weird, the way you said that. I mean, I, I don't want to do this, but I uh, kind of have to kill some uh, juvenile trees, I think. Wait, it, uh, wait you want to be here, Corsal? Yeah, if you don't mind. Uh, no, that's fine. Uh, we'll just uh, put you down a house. Come on. Huh. Hold on. Why does this not obstruct it? Seriously. In the other town, the little chaotic. Hebrew, no. We're Hebrew. All right, let's make some extra uh, twigs while we're at it. I mean, it's one of the good things of having the uh, thing up here. Uh, I mean, I need them to build the house, but uh, okay, maybe I can at least build a blueprint for him. Should be good. Uh, can you move a tiny bit to the? Yeah, thank you, thank you. Oh, hold on, let me grab more twigs. Ooh. Uh, wait, where did the twigs go? Oh, put them in here. Uh, wait. Yeah, we'll just need, uh, three more twigs, so let's uh, find some branches and we'll, uh, get you a house there. Uh, I think to the south here should be more. Do, 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 do. Oh, I at least have my flint spear, so... Oh. I, I think I'm used to uh, killing bears with spare... Spears? Spears is the word. I want to say spares. Spears. <laughs> Uh, from a couple of tests back when you could make them in the tool maker or whatever that was called. So those were better spears. Now with the flint system, uh, they're like basically very flimsy, which is fine. Flimsy, flimsy. I should have gone for the pun. They're, they're very flimsy. Uh, 
All right. I mean, we need more, but uh, we'll do Corsal's house first. And then we'll... Uh, like... At least partial. We, we, we need a wall. It's, uh, it's very unfortunate, but uh, yeah, we need to have it. Three more. Uh, who's... Wait, how, what, what's he doing here? Just stop taking all the fucking twigs, man. Uh, question mark, can you hear me? I don't know how to name you, man. Uh, what do we call you, question mark? Uh, Corsal, I got the uh, twigs. Come. Corsal, Corsal, come. All right, make sure to set your... Uh... There you go, you should be patched now, right? Yeah, you are. Yeah, 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 yeah. Good, good, good. All right. Uh, we'll go... We'll... It's so... Well, I, I don't want to do this. I have to. I'm sorry, boys. I really am sorry, but I have to. This might be, uh... Oh, oof. Alright, uh, let's see if I can kill the freaking bear. Like, uh, this is what always happens, right? Anybody who's seen this <laughs> or knows I want to do too many things at the same time. Definitely not something you should be doing. Just die already, stupid bear. Don't pause. Sorry, bad pun. Come on. Takes forever. I'll be making some coffee. I'll be back in like a minute or so. All right, uh, let's respawn and see if I can get my shit back. 
And we did upgrade, did we? Ah. This... This is why people need to acknowledge that they can hear what I'm saying. I'm not trying to have somebody in. They can do in their in my town, our town, I should say, whatever they want. That's fine. Uh, but if I tell you that it's probably not for the best and wait, you should wait for a uh, wall, then maybe, you know, you should wait for a wall. I'm sorry. I'm, I'm, I'm fine. I'm fine. I mean, this is how we learn, right? It's the... Let's go solo tanking in Foxhole. And then find out that you can't shoot when you're soloing. Yeah, F, that's your fault. I'll blame you, buddy. Buddy boy. There we go. So the mission was actually killing the bear, but uh, that changed to... Uh, Wait, I didn't grab the flint spear? Oh, that takes time. Wolf, 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 wolf. Come on, four? It's, it's just not necessary. Just all you need to do is wait. Just wait. Wait till the wall is ready. Come on. That's all I needed. <laughs> um, uh, oh. Come on, I'll get a shitload of stuff except what I need, right? Yeah. Uh, now I don't know where the spear is because I forgot I threw it. Damn it. All right. All right. Uh, I need some twigs. There, there's nothing much I can do here. I need twigs. I need to make spears. And once I have spears, I can go try to kill the freaking... Is the game any good? Uh, yeah, frustrating, but uh, it's it's good. I do enjoy it personally, quite a lot. Uh, it's pre-alpha, so uh, people think and look at it and say, yeah, it's pretty coming along pretty nice. But uh, just keep in mind that uh, it's not only pre-alpha. Genesis, ты случайно не знаешь, как это выбросить из инвентаря? It's Russian. Okay, I don't know any Russian. Uh. I mean, I can yell Kurwa, but that's Polish. I mean, I can count to three in Russian. It's not helpful, I think, right? So it is pre-alpha. Uh, things keep changing a lot. Uh, systems come, disappear, get back in a different form. So uh, we shouldn't necessarily count on what we see as being... Wait, was that a wolf? Oh, for fuck's sake. Oh. Come on! Ugh. Damn it! Uh, now I have to find... Uh, seriously, people, come on.
Oh, where? Oh, fuck's sake. Fuck, there's more fucking wolves. Come on. Oh, fuck me. Oh, this is what you get. I'm not too angry. I'm just getting some coffee. Now, it's not exactly the same. Like, I, I always laugh. Like, when new players, like, start digging trenches and you say, just remember, trenches can be used by the enemy as well. It's, I mean, it's all fine and dandy and shit. Uh, I don't mind. But here, the issue is, once Wolf starts attacking your city, or your town, I should say, it's very, very hard. Very hard to keep work doing work because your work is going to be hampered by the fucking wolves and you have to respawn and oh uh, it's just come on game there we go i'll cheese the shit out of it then look at it and there's a wolf inside. We can't. Oh. But I so the issue, like I said, the issue is it's very hard to be in town now because in town you will be constantly chased by wolves because the wolves are there constantly. Like it's just don't. But the game should basically say it doesn't. The game basically should say that, right? Like, if you go tier 2 town hall. No, okay, so they spawn uh, out of nowhere, these ones. Uh, oh, somebody even upgraded their house. Oh, goddammit. Fuck me. Hey, Freak, aren't there supposed to be nodes up here, man? Uh, there is iron nodes here, yes. Oh, okay. Cool. We're not, not interested in taking anything from you. We'll, uh, find some other place. Careful, careful. Somebody let the wolves in. Yeah, sorry. Don't need. Oh, wow. They did something with the wolf AI. They're smarter. So, yeah, these uh, sort of uh, spawn out of nowhere. Um, uh, but that's because we have a tier two town hall. That's, that's why they spawn out of nowhere. Basically, that's, that's basically the point. Uh, so we have to kill them. But in two days, if I'm not mistaken, there will be, uh, they will start spawning again. So we have to kill them now and finish our wall. But where didn't I have a second spear? Like they keep spawning now. Like oh, come on. There we go. What is this madness? <laughs> Oh. 
Like I said, we shouldn't have upgraded to town ulti tier two. We needed a wool first. But no, no. Now we have to deal with spawning wolves. Damn it. <laughs> Oh crap, and the bears are back. Are you kidding me? Come on. Ugh. Your great grandfather killed a bear once. Bear was sleeping on the side of a cliff. Grandfather snuck up on him and pushed him. Nice. That is nice. <laughs> We can't. Oh, come on. Why can't we store the deer meat? Oh, this is annoying. You're welcome. Donkey sigh. The issue is we're spending <laughs> I've been spending the last what 25 minutes fucking dealing with the stupid wolves it's just, Why can't I like Uh, look at it. Come on. I'm so tired of this. Come on. This is how we get, like, this is how you get that uh, new people are getting booted from games, right? Like, yeah, and it have, could have all been prevented if uh, Lev probably would have spoken English, which he doesn't. Uh, I mean, I can't blame him for not, you know, how, how is there pines? Okay. What's that in my house? I don't understand. Yeah, uh, yeah, just log off. Nice. But what I wanted to say, this is how uh, in Foxhole, noobs get, like, uh, roasted for doing something they don't know. And it, the same thing will happen in Anvil if there is no good system of preventing this. Yeah, so uh, that was what I was trying to explain to Lev, that he should have stopped upgrading the town hall and that he should have waited until we had a wall. Which he didn't. And now that we don't have a wall, we constantly have wolves. And there's sh jack shit we can do because we keep dying. And here's the thing, like this is this is the way you get people to kill noobs just in the off chance that they will do something stupid, right? Like people will just go, yeah, I don't want him to fuck up my uh my town, right? Like, here, it's just... <sighs> so, and here, the issue is left couldn't know. But, right, there is no... Uh, if he doesn't speak English, uh, well, that's it. Right? If he doesn't know, he doesn't know. That's... I mean, it's not something he absolutely should have known. I mean, I tried to tell him, but again, if he doesn't speak English, then he doesn't speak English. I don't want to open my house. Just give me the spear. Oh, 
All right, that's that one. Uh, but is this just <sighs> taking too much time, man? Wait, in game? I don't know. So again, the issue, like, I don't, I like, this sounds like I'm blaming Lev, and I, like, in a sense, it is his fault, but also he, like, there is no way for him to know, not really, that, that upgrading a town hall to tier two will actually make it so that wolves start to spawn uh, towards your town. I like, I really do like the gameplay uh, that it uh, basically provides, right? It, it makes you... Uh, it forces you to make sure that you have a good base, basically. Like you can't just uh, just start building and building and building. And I like that's good. I, I like that. I hear another wolf already. Oh, I didn't want to yell, but... Well, here we are. That's the game obligation to make mechanics clear to the player or at least assist. Well, let's be honest. This is pre-alpha, so... Uh, and here's another thing. I like that it's not clear to players. In a sense. I, I don't know if that makes sense, right? You have to sort of find out. That... that I both like and dislike. Like, I, I like it because I know it. I dislike it because it also means that... Uh, if people don't know. There's issues. Oh, there we go. Yeah, exactly. So, but there is no good reason to know that, uh... Uh, there is no, uh, I mean, uh, so, okay, no, no, let me go back to, uh, so, please tell me he didn't, oh, no, 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 no. So, this is even worse, right? He built his hut. He built his hut. on the edge of where you can build. And now I can't finish the wall because the wall will not go up against the house. So I will not be able to keep animals out because this house is here. I cannot blow up this house because it's his house. But do get back to the to the game mechanic. I like the mechanic of like okay. So if you're uh, having a better civilization or whatever you want to call it, uh, like that will attract, I don't know, rats or wolves in this case. That that's not like there need to be detriments to getting a better house. Yeah, I don't want to. No, I don't want to burn it down. That's just gonna be silly. Uh, just I need a hammer and wait. What's the uh, settlement marker these days? Twenty planks. Come on. Hello, Genesis. Like for one, I just uh. <sighs> I think there needs to be, I don't know, there needs to be a way that you can, like, I've, I've had this issue before, like, there is a good chance I can't even do uh, a wall here. Oh, that's fine. Is there another wolf? Come on! You come on, guys. Just fuck me. Just stop getting Let's put some more tweaks in fucking
so I, I uh, to get back to the gameplay, I like the fact that you have to like pre-plan things and need to keep zones clear to be able to build certain things or do certain things. The issue is, as we can see here, is people can build stuff at places where you don't want it. Uh, and especially if they build stuff that... I, I can't blow up his house, which is also kind of uh, not necessarily a bad thing, nor a good thing, to be completely honest. Uh, I mean, it just is. Lumber camp. Where am I going to put my lumber camp? Because everything is in the way. There we go. I'll dismantle that as well. Come on. I have to redo everything. How we can expand a little bit? Yeah, I'm ex I am expanding, but uh I need room to we really need that wall because things will steep keep spawning here. Uh can you pick up yeah. these uh, branches? Uh, wait, sorry, uh, Jan, was there a uh, question? If yes, that's the sole reason you won't buy this. Well, for one, I can already give you the answer. Uh, you can't buy it, so, I mean, that should help you kind of uh, there already. Can you, uh, can you finish the uh, workbench? I think you have the branches, right? Yeah, thanks. Wolf, 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 wolf. I can see it. I understand it's still in development. It seems like building is still broken as it was in Foxhole. No and yes. Okay, so the, it's completely different building. Well, not completely different isn't uh, the correct word, I think. Um, but it's different. Uh, they are working on ways to uh, circumvent some uh, annoying things. There we go. Oh, no, no, no. This is not for the most random reasons. Okay, so for uh, maybe it's for the for you the most random reasons. I mostly know why I can't. Uh, in most instances. Uh, in this case, it's this house is in the way. Uh, like, this is our built area. This house needs to go. But I can't... But I can't dismantle it. It's it's one of the issues that I don't like. Now I can make uh, I have More 15 clear. planks. Well, the issue is we can't. Yeah, we can't take it down. Only uh, we can torch it down. I don't want to do that because it's somebody's home. We can build a settlement marker so we extend our settlement. But for that, I need uh, 20 planks. So if we get more planks, uh, we just extend our uh, range and then it's fine. We'll just build around. I need a hammer. Okay. Not enough resources. What do I need? Flint. Are you telling me we don't have flint anymore? God damn it. Uh, so, okay. So I can destroy everything except houses. I am the founder of the town. Uh, that means I can destroy uh, all the production building, all the walls, all the things. Everything that is in the way, I can blow up. The only thing that I cannot blow up is the one thing I need to get rid of, which is the uh, is the house. But the house is okay. So the the house is a special case, and I do understand the house is a special case because uh, you need a house in order to pledge to a town, and you need to pledge to a town to be able to spawn there. So it's not like setting your spawn in Foxhole. It's different. Like you belong to a town. You, in a sense, you belong more to a town than you belong to the faction. 
I mean, that's not entirely true, but your first concern should be your town, not your faction. Wait. Hello, gentlemen. Hello. You right? Yeah, Hello. I'm right. I'm just looking for some flint. I'm not sure how are they getting this close to me. Uh. No, so Cruncher, that is basically what I have. Like I said, the only exception is houses. Like I can blow up uh, the armor maker. I can blow up the the smithy. I can blow up the water wheel. I can presumably blow up anything that's within the settlement that I'm the founder of. With the exception, the sole exception is the thing that is in the way, which is a house. Yeah, no, it's not an issue. No, 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 no it doesn't matter. I mean, some people don't know, other people know, and just, you know. I have flint for you, Frey. Oh, nice. Yeah, thank you. Well, that's much appreciated. Ah, oh, thanks, buddy. If I could commend you, I would, but <laughs> this is the wrong game, that's cool, unfortunately. Man. Don't need no comments. Thanks, mate. Thanks. Yeah, so uh, for the people who don't know, I'll 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 show it in a bit. So uh, there is a way, uh, Cruncher. Uh, so the founder can do that, but there is also a role that can do that, and that full role can be voted for. Uh, that's called a thane. So people that are uh pledged to a town when you do stuff in that town like uh make planks but uh, i don't know you know do uh just do things uh make what, what did i say make planks make sticks whatever stuff like that uh if you do that uh, a meter starts running that will sort of uh increase your status once you are churl i think i'll, I'll have to go to the town hall in a bit to show you uh, you can be voted in as a thane, and as soon as you are thane, like the thanes, like the vikings had. Oh, well, it's not the same. But you basically get the uh, powers that a founder also has. So anybody who's voted as thane can also destroy buildings within town limits. With, again, the exception of houses, because houses are important. So it's the uh, it's the weird it, it's the hardest edge case and it has been an edge case for uh, basically since we've been testing uh, randoms come to a town they poop down a house because they learned that that's how you pledge to a town they're not necessarily you know they're not like uh, question mark whatever his name is he didn't do this on purpose right he didn't fuck up on purpose that's not what he was doing. We have uh, storage for uh, Flint. Uh, right now, I am the storage for Flint. I have a shitload of Flint. Uh, if you have sticks, you can make a new resource pile and just put Flint in, flint in there. Uh, you need 10 sticks, I think, right? Resource stockpile is 10. Yeah, so that is, like, it's been going up and down. Like, uh, we've had tests where you could just uh, willy-nilly blow up houses. And we've had tests where we basically have this, where you can't. And I think right now the system is uh, you can... You can blow up houses, but you can only blow up houses of people that are offline. So if somebody is online, you can't uh, demolish their house. Wait, build site obstructed. Are you telling me? There we go. So uh, I'll, I'll show you in the town hall in a bit. Oh, I don't have planks anymore. Planks.
<laughs> almost there, almost there. Just a couple of more planks. I have three, I have three. Not enough space anywhere. How to drop? Alt click, alt click will drop. Ooh. What type of coffee do I drink? Uh, what, what are we talking about type of coffee? Like, I'm not a coffee nut, so... Well, I am a coffee nut in the sense that I like my coffee. Uh, like, I need coffee, but that's more like a neat than I go for flavor. So I have uh, what we call is basically a red mark, which is... I'll have to look that up, what the actual, like international term would be oh, yeah. that's always a good fix just make sure that people can't do shit so this is basically what i can do everywhere and i think i can also blow up uh No, uh, no, no, not beans, not instant. Like uh, it's pre, uh, pre grounded, and it goes into a percolator. Wait, I think percolator is sort of the thing. I, uh, I mean, I don't know. Check. Yeah, so I have just a filter. I put uh, pre-ground coffee in the filter and then the coffee machine will pump hot water into the filter and that will percolate through the filter into a can of coffee. Yeah. Uh, I don't want to do this because it's, it's very bad form to chop uh, down uh, very young... No, 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 no. Uh, I used to do honey because I don't like the very sharp uh, sweetness of crystal sugar. Well, we call it crystal sugar. Table sugar, I think, is the uh, English term. Uh, I don't like that, so I used to use honey. Uh, but I'm almost 40, so uh, well, that's a very weird thing to say out of the blue. But uh, no, that means uh, I, for my entire life, I've never been uh, too heavy. And I suddenly start uh, putting on weight, so I had to... Um, so I cut the honey out of my coffee. I mean, I'm not getting fat or anything. It's just, uh, yeah, I got a bit more uh, chubby than I hoped I would become. Well, we, I mean, you can make the wood blanks, but we don't have a smithy. So, I mean, I, I, I'm not going to. That's the point. Uh, v. V will open it. There we go. So yeah, I, I don't necessarily dislike sweetness. Like, I, I kind of like sweetness. It's just uh, sweetness of sugar is too sharp. Uh, and honey has, uh, well, less sharpness. Does sharpness make sense in this? Uh, do people understand what I mean when I say sharpness? Yeah, well, okay, so to get back to good or bad coffee, I don't care for good or bad coffee. I just care whether or not it has caffeine. If it has caffeine, I assume that it's going to be good coffee, right? Yeah. 
No, it's not bitterness. No, it's it's sharp. Like the sweetness of sugar is different than the sweetness of honey. I'm pretty sure that makes sense. Yeah, exactly. It's it's very smooth. It's like but uh sugar, at least the sugar we have is like bam. Like you, yeah, it hits direct exactly. That's the thing. Yeah, it hits you in the face and you're like bam. Wow, that's sweet. Right? It is floral, yes, yes. But I mean, basically it's still sugar. No, no, good, 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 good. But yeah, uh, I used to drink way more coffee and I used to drink coffee with sugar. Yeah, you, you shouldn't. Yeah. Honey uh, apparently is good, yes. But, you know, it depends on how much honey you use. There we go. Yeah, I don't... Like, it's like saying water is good for you. That's true. But if you drink 10 liters of water in half an hour, you still die. So, you know. You can't even stand that. Uh, no Irish coffee for you? Like, there is a fat chance. Okay, I'm lucky. Uh... Uh, the wood that the bear like basically fits through that, right? Oh no 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 no! Mama! Mama! <laughs> Mistakes were made. <laughs> uh, I was climbing the mine. I was climbing the mine and I was like, this is going to go wrong because I'm going to sc scoot down the wrong side. Uh, I was right about that. <laughs> Got me killed, but uh, I was right about that. Drink Irish coffee. Everything to make it at home, not me, just because you're not a fan. Yeah, I know that's fair enough. Yeah. I barely got mold. It's fine. Where the hell do they spawn now? Because we killed the previous spawn, right? There we go. Uh, I just wanted to kill the freaking bear. These bears are thicker than the black bears. The black bears are relatively, relatively simple to kill. Stop chasing me, you bastard. <laughs> Let's bring him to our neighbors. But yeah, I quit uh, drinking, uh, what, 10 years ago? Yeah, I haven't touched a drink. Not 10 years, almost 10 years ago. They're all big chunkers, man. All the bears are big chunkers. I love them. Uh, the problem is they love me and they love me to death. It's a bit sad. But yeah, you need, I don't know, you need a lot of spear throwing to kill a bear, unfortunately. Careful, question mark, careful. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Oh. No, I didn't want to open the gate. What are you doing, game? 
Don't be weird now. <laughs> oh, this is such a foxhole problem. You hit, uh... Hello, Mr. Medieval. Hey, is, is, is this okay to use for everybody? Uh, not for everybody, but if you ask nicely, I can, uh, give you some, uh, iron ore. That's not an issue. No, oh, sure. Do you, do you need anything no, specific? No, nah, just, uh... Yeah, if we ask for some stuff, just be nice and bring us some stuff. But yeah, just uh, feel free to uh, take some shit. It's fine. That's amazing. Absolutely. Anything you need. Thank you. Yeah. I mean, don't forget we're all uh, wearing the white bath ropes, right? Yeah. <laughs> True. Uh, there is a spear here somewhere. Oh, this is amazing. Thanks for it. You're welcome. Like, I don't, I don't have use for all this. Wait, iron. do we bring this back to the forge? Uh, My first you time put doing these this. into the wait, the furnace or the forge? One of those, uh, if I forget, and then you turn it into iron ingots, and then you can start using your uh, hammer and anvil stuff. Is it like three fragments for one ingot, and then one of these for one ingot, kind of? Uh, I think it's even better. I. Th but uh, I didn't really pay attention last test. I think it is one of these for two ingots even, but I might be wrong. Uh, oh but it's definitely, oh, not, it's definitely not three of those for one ingot. So this is definitely way better than the uh, wild spawning iron. Yes, that's true. Awesome. Thanks so much. Oh, you're welcome. All right, uh, what was I doing? I was trying to kill the freaking bear. Uh, I also definitely want a pickaxe so I can uh, store some uh, stuff for myself as well, uh, some iron. Like, I, I don't mind sharing stuff, but it's, you know, sharing. So they shouldn't, like... Uh, and they won't. Uh, Sarah Medieval, I don't know him very well, but uh, what I've seen from him, he seems to be a reasonable dude, so seem the IG guys. And one of the issues I see a lot, uh, even with my own clan, which is not really a clan, but kind of a clan, like, people are so protective and not willing to cooperate uh, that others will not cooperate either. Like, somebody has to do the first step, right? Like, somebody has to say, eh, 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 all right, you know, you can have stuff, that's fine. Does it make sense? Right? There's nothing wrong with saying, hey, uh, you know, there is a reason I started this town here. Uh, there is a very good reason I started this town here. But me, like, hoarding and saying nobody gets this is also counterproductive. Like, like I said to Sir Medieval, like, you know, if I ask for stuff and you send me that, uh, I think we're fine. Yeah. Yeah, not necessarily hoarders. It's, it's, uh, I don't think people are necessarily against working together. People are afraid. Like, we're, uh, a, a uh, low trust society, right? So most people don't necessarily trust that if they do something for somebody else, that they will get it back. Am I making sense? Yeah, so everybody, and, uh, people aren't, and again, I don't think people are necessarily against uh, sharing and helping. They're just afraid that, okay, I'm going to give the iron. And then when I call on, let's let's uh, take Sarah Medieval as an example, uh, just how paranoid people can be. Like, I would say, okay, sure, you can have the uh, iron. And then I, you know, I, I we basically split it 50-50 and, you know, I need food or whatever. And I just go, Sir Medieval and your town, can you please send me, I don't know, uh, like iron stuff. And they say, no, that's what everybody is afraid of, is, is, is my assessment. And the same goes for Foxhole. Like, I made the video, the Build Back, or Build Back Better video, and people like the idea of making one communal sort of... Uh... one communal facility for all the M subs, but people are afraid that they will contribute more than that they will get out. So uh, people like to do karma points. 
And I am a uh, sharing person from myself. Like, I don't need to hoard stuff for myself. I don't care. I just want people to have fun. Uh, so I'm like, you know, I, I'm usually the one, and this is not to pat myself on the back or anything, but I'm usually the one that goes, yeah, sure, you can use my stuff. I don't mind. Like, and I don't necessarily mind if somebody would come to our resource stockpile here and take some. They can't, but, you know, I, I wouldn't necessarily care too much. Uh, Edgar, you missed the most important part. I was smart enough that while he was getting mauled to close the gate. Like a real... <laughs> Like a real friend, right? I saw him get mauled and I decided, you know what? This seems about the right time to close the gate. <laughs> it's like um, The Walking Dead, right? You see somebody getting mauled by zombies and you basically go, well, yeah, that sucks. Uh, so no, right now there is not really trade in the game, matey. But it is definitely something that is on the uh, roadmap. So they really want it. We've had one iteration of trade uh, that didn't really work. Uh, but they fully intend, and I can show you. Uh, well, I'm probably not going to be able to show you. But uh, the distribution of resources is so that, for instance, uh, I don't have stone. So we have iron, and there's iron here, but there is no stone. Uh, the nearest stone mine here. No, that's silver. So uh, that's... that's uh, It's definitely something they want. The, the trading thing. So like inter... At least within your own faction, but you know, I... Personally, would love to see the faction play a smaller role and just go like, oh, my town needs stone or something and just go, uh, yeah. Oh, yeah, no, you can do that. Yes, yes, you can do that. But I don't necessarily know what my town needs right now. I'll, uh, but yeah, if, if I need stuff, I'll just ask, uh, uh, Ser Medieval. Uh, I mean, I'm assuming it's going to be, uh, stone bricks that we'll need. Uh, don't put... Uh, yeah, yeah, this is another thing that the game doesn't explain, right? Uh, uh, I need three twigs. I mean... Branches. That's what I need. We need more food. Just don't have branches. Let's just wait until it's done. Yeah. All right, uh, I'll go find some branches, I hope. Yeah, I think you're full of uh, Ekotov. Yeah, there you go. Can you as a player just go around and build villages and stuff instead of go around and do conflicts? Yes. So basically, okay, so it's it's a bit complicated, right? Uh, because we're testing specifically settlement building right now. So you can definitely do that. But even in a PvP test that are uh, quite specifically meant to test uh, out to PvP uh, game mechanics, uh, you still have to build a town. Now, the issue right now is space. Uh, I can show you in a bit. Uh, let me store the iron ore first, uh, matey. Um, Oi, matey. I can't do a pirate accent, so I shouldn't. Uh, so, if you want to start a town, it needs to be far enough away from any other town. So, this is roughly... Uh, iron wood and iron bridge are as close roughly as you can get towns together. So that means that if you are, let's say you would get access to the pre-alpha right now and you want to start your own town, the only option right now is to start one here between Ironwood and Crow Hill, Crow Hill somewhere around here. If you start it here, that's it. This entire area, you can't build new towns. Uh, same goes 
uh, around here. You can probably put one down here, but that's going to be close, yeah. Uh, right now, we've been busy for three hours. And that's with five people. Uh, now, there was a half an hour where we had to deal with wolves because we upgraded our town hall to tier two too early. Uh, right now, it's way smaller than Fox Hall. But if you check the... F I think it's the first dev blog they have on their Steam page. Uh, what they intend, it is going to be way bigger than what Fox Hall is. And it will not have like the... You will travel from server to server in a sense. But not like you do in Foxhole. So you don't get into a queue. You don't have to wait. It's more how it worked in Life is Feudal. If you remember that. Or if you played that, I should say. So if you played Life is Feudal, you sort of know what sort of they're going for with the uh, server uh, things. Uh, what was I doing? Branches. I needed more branches. Why did I need more branches? There was a reason I needed more branches. I forgot what, but there's bound to be a good reason somewhere. Here's branches and flint. But yeah, the, the, the way this game seems to go is like, tr if you want to just have a town and trade with your own faction, uh, besides some raiding or being in a warpath, uh, should definitely be possible. Now, the downside to that is your time investment will be huge. And still, the sort of the end goal of the game will obviously be to just uh, defeat the enemy in a sense, right? So uh, take all the enemy's town halls or whatever we want to call it or destroy all of them. Or... So uh, you're not going to live out your entire life in peace, presumably. Then again, this is pre-alpha. There might be a system somehow... Maybe, I don't know, that uh, makes it so that there is sort of backlines where you can't really be attacked. I don't know. That could be true. Wait, are they deforesting? <laughs> are you deforesting towards my town? <laughs> we are, uh, we are yeah. as we no, go. No, it's fine, it's fine. It's not an issue. It's just, it's just funny that, like, you know... At this start, at this point in the game, everybody is just fighting over trees. <laughs> That's fine. No, uh, we don't fight. It's good. Yeah, we, we, we share everything. Good to hear, boys. Good to hear. Thank you. Uh, so uh, we have confirmation that there will be a third faction, the pagans. Uh, we just don't have them yet. So right now there's two factions, uh, the uh, Ancients and us, the Remnant. Oh. Everybody is coming here for the uh, iron now. Uh, if you guys could, uh, when you come back, uh, drop us some weapons so we can deal with the bears, that would be much appreciated, boys. Take that one. The one I dropped. Ah, Free. okay. Yeah, thanks, 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 thanks. That's, that's for all. Broad, broad axe. Tear one. Thank you. Thank you very much. No worries. Uh, well, I've, 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 I've found uh, those guys before and I already told them that it's fine that they take some. Uh, it, it seriously is important that they don't take everything. Uh, I don't have enough resources. What am I missing? I have flint. Ah! Uh, I need, uh, twigs. There we go. Now, it's just you need to be, uh, you just need to think about things, right? 
Like if I take the uh, resource, if I make the resource stockpile and put our iron ore in, uh, only people, as far as I know, only people that have access, uh, that are pledged to our town should have access to that. If that is not the case, it is at least implicit uh, that it's ours, right? That doesn't mean that everybody will abide by it, but uh, like I said, I'm not too fussed generally if stuff gets uh, ps ps stolen. Like, it's where all the insanity starts, generally speaking. Is when people start caring too much about what they have. Now, I, I do understand that if you made a battle tank or whatever, uh, you don't... No, 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 no! Oh, god damn it! I need to get my timing better. I know that eventually the bear will turn around, right? I mean, maybe I can, uh, I can cage it in. That would be cool. I just need my stuff back now. There, right? Yeah. Hi. Where's the spear? It has to be around here somewhere as well, right? There's a spear. Use it to execute. <laughs> that would, would be good, yeah. Are you telling me there, who let the bear in? Come on, boys. Don't do this. It's fine that you come and take our iron, but for the love of God, don't let bears into this settlement. Unleash the battle bears when the ancients come. Uh, we can do like um, uh, the golden compass, right? Like uh, the uh, the uh, Panzer Pans bear or whatever they're called. Jurek Eiserborn or whatever his face is. Yorick, and he's not Yorick, Yorick, he's called Yorick, right? Uh, it's not, Yorick Panzerborn, maybe? I don't know, he had a cool name. Uh, where is the spear, spear, spear? Oh, there it is. No, there we go, yeah. No, yeah, there we go. That's the one, there we go. A lot of iron around. Oh, bear, 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 bear. I mean, I think it's too fantasy for Anvil, but my God, I would love it to write my uh, answer bear. If you need iron ore, I have iron ore in iron wood too. Just let me know if you need it. I mean, you'll have to come get it because I'm too lazy to bring it to you, but yeah. Still not dead. 
my trap baron cage step three step four what you can do and uh i think it was trilkin or red donut i i'll have to figure out who it was uh somebody used it might be robert loves games as well i don't know somebody managed to uh while we were being sort of invaded to uh lure a bear behind him and run into the enemy and you basically used the bear to attack uh the enemy oh pretty funny really like that uh he's going to turn around right yeah he's going to turn around so uh we'll go around so you can definitely use him as a weapon but it's like uh it's untamable so you kind of have to uh like be smart about it but you can definitely do it Where is it? There we go. How many spears does it need in it, Ars? Come on. Oof. Still not dead? Very chunky boy. Oh, come on. I mean, it's got a dice. I mean, in a sense, maybe we say, okay, they have very thick skin and I have only flint spears, so that's... That's the issue. Can do that. Uh-oh, it broke. It broke. Where is So there's wolves here as well. Alpha wolves, damn it. Uh, so yeah, I think we need uh, better uh, gear to deal with that. Anyway. I have a broad axe, so there's that. Does your, does your log? I can't remember. I have no idea if it's ours or yours. Where's the where's the tree I cut down? I need more. Oh crap! Who did that? I don't mind choosing this. Careful, careful, careful. Don't, don't, just, just wait till it's done. Because it might actually free itself. I hope not, but... Oh, come on! This is a very sturdy bear. I put five spears in him already. Yeah, I've been chasing a bear earlier and I at least put 10 spears in him. So, uh, takes forever. <laughs> you guys are seriously going to cook while I try to kill a bear? <laughs> yes. <laughs> That's fucking hilarious. 
We don't have a popcorn, so at least maybe some stew. What did I say? Don't do anything. <laughs> I'm not sure if I'm actually hitting him, because, by God. All right, tip for everybody that wants to play Anvil Empires. Um, communicate. That's, that's all I'm going to say, just, just communicate. <laughs> that was a friendly kill. I need some coffee. Let's see if I still have coffee. Branches. I know why I wanted branches. I want another fire pit. Down. That's it. Uh, I need a animal processing thing. That's almost done. Uh, no, oh, oh, stop. I, <laughs> I can't, I can't explain to him. Don't do that. It fucks up the, uh, it fucks up. The, it fucks up the recipes. Stop doing that. Why? Game, let me fucking put that in. Jesus, motherfucking Christ. The storage rules, I've, I've, I've put this as a... Uh, as feedback already, but the storage rules, they're so fucking annoying. I'm so tired of... Like, it's, it's, it's not obvious. Uh, what can go where and why and ugh, man, come on. It's very frustrating because uh, with it's one of the uh, things that you have like in survival games right, as well, right? Like if your inventory is full, like inventory management is very important. I, I, I mean, I, I get it. It is important. Fine. Good. Uh, oh, people are just eating, not doing anything else. Okay, great. Uh, but yeah, the, uh, inventory management games, they're uh, not my favorite. Let's put it like that. It is uh, pretty efficient. Cool. Yes. 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 Uh, I've seen it in ovens. I've seen it in fire pits, and I've seen it in whatever the the thing is that you use to uh, stoke up your iron bar. So yeah, I'm assuming everything, yeah. Mm. 
so this is uh like i said this is one of the issues you have to uh uh, there's generally uh, food in the town hall. I'm I'm cooking now to get some stuff in the town hall. I mean, preferably more people put stuff in the town hall as well. But that's not gonna happen, is it? It's not that people are selfish. It's uh, that they're egotistical. <laughs> That's not true. Well, it's true. They are. Uh, I get it. Like, it's... Uh, right now, cooking isn't... Like, you're just uh, juggling two inventories or three inventories or, or whatever the amount of inventories is you're cooking with. Uh, which is... Like, it's... It's... Not great. Right now. I like... I Again, I like that it requires effort to keep every keep everybody fat and especially with the hunger system and having to eat different types of food that's all fine and dandy i don't mind it, it it's just it's mind numbing to make sure that your town is fat like just not worth it like you basically have to do this a lot. Uh, I mean, ideally, you do like like five fire pits in a row and just to make an insane amount of uh, berry things and just go, yeah, that's it. Uh, everybody just deal with that and, you know. Uh, you can have chickens that will give you eggs. Uh, eggs will allow you to make uh, the anvil equivalent of a... Um, or an omelet um you can have fish but in order to make fish you need an oven like you can't unfortunately and i'll throw it in feedback again but you can't roast a fish in a fire pit which still blows my mind I get it. They want towns to upgrade so once they upgrade they get uh, access to better food because uh, roasted fish is way better food than uh, other. But yeah. Good afternoon from Mrs. Wait, I, I, Mrs. Mrs. Soga, Mrs. Soga, Mrs. Mrs. Soga, Mrs. Soga. Uh, you cannot right now mine into the mountains, so there is no uh terrain. You can't do anything with to the terrain right now. Uh, I need a new pickaxe. Three planks, two fiber and two flint. Okay, so three planks. One, two, three. That's not bad. That's a very polite way of saying that my pronunciation sucks, but you do appreciate the effort. So, uh, it seemed reasonable to at least say that's not bad. It's the, uh, equivalent of, uh, no offense. Right? That's fine. It's fine. It's okay. I can live with that. Do we have any twigs? Uh, I have two twigs if you need them. Or branches, whatever. I'll drop them. I just need an uh, axe. Uh, wait, was I not making a pickaxe? What am I missing? Not enough reason. Oh, fiber. I just put the fiber in there. I'm stupid. People, I'm stupid. Go off. There we go. Uh, see, this is why we have a wall, so that the wolves stay outside. I'm not mad, Johnny. It's just, you know, it's a. Uh, it's hard to uh, do pronunci English pronunciation because it's never clear how things are supposed to be pronounced. I do understand that for an English speaking person, that's usually 
it's sort of obvious, but... Like, the first time I heard about uh, Yosemite, I didn't understand, because I always thought it was a uh, Josemite Park. But apparently it's Yosemite. Who fucking knew? Yeah, at least, like, I'm Dutch. Uh, like, 95% of spelling, if not more, makes it clear how to pronounce a, uh... How to pronounce a word. Like, if, if, if somebody spelled it correctly, you know how to pronounce it. Like, 95, 99%, maybe, even. Maybe I'm, I'm, uh, under, uh, under value. Uh, but yeah, it's, I mean, the issue in Canada, I'm assuming the same as in the US, is there are names that come from the, uh, wait, you call it First Nations, which would be the Native Americans in America, and they sort of get anglicized, right? Yeah. Your son-in-law is Dutch. I feel very sorry for you to have to deal with him. I mean, I don't know. I don't know your son-in-law, but, um, you yeah. know? How do you find let's let's just go with the obvious uh, with the obvious question how do you find the uh dutch uh directness or rudeness depending on uh you know who says uh like i always hear a lot about it i like i i grew up in it so i don't really know uh even on the internet most people internationally did i speak don't seem to be that much less direct than I am. But maybe in like real life it's different. But yeah, seriously, most people I international I know quite a lot of uh like I have a lot of international friends. Wait, that sounds like I'm bragging. I've met a lot of people online from a lot of different countries and I've never felt that people were overly polite. I think one of the issues uh, online, one of the reasons for that online is that for a lot of people that I meet online, English is their second or third language. So that automatically makes you, well, automatically is maybe not the right word, but sort of, sort of automatically makes you less polite because you just have less words to work with. So you're trying to not beat around the bush too much, I think. Van den Tillaert. Are you sure he's Dutch? That sounds like a Belgian name. Which, truth be told, uh, they're reserve Dutch, depending on where they are from. But, uh, but yeah. When it's, like, uh, smashed together, like, the Dutch, literal Dutch variant that I would expect, personally, would be Van den Tillaert. So it would be three words. He's Dutch. No, it's it's fine. It's fine. I, I wasn't taking away his passport or anything. But if I see like uh, like the Americanized versions of like uh, Vanderbilt and stuff like that, that that's usually uh, the Belgians do that. So the Belgians will have a uh, van den Bore, and that will be one word. Whereas the Dutch variant of that would be van den Bore. That would be three words. Although, to be fair, if he's from the Southern Netherlands, that would make him a reserve Belgian, and then, you know, everything makes sense again, so. But anyhow, uh, let's not talk about your son-in-law, right? That's just weird. How are things? Oh, bear. Bear. Is Stickle a Dutch name? I mm, uh, no. Not that. No, don't do this. Don't do this. Go outside and die. Rirk. Yes, come on, come on. Yes, there we go. Close the door. Somebody close the... Why did I do that? I'm stupid. I should have closed the door. Damn it. My bad. If there is a wolf in town, I blame me. It's not an issue. No, no, no. You didn't get me killed. I'm uh, more than capable. Uh, I'm perfectly capable of getting myself killed without somebody intervening. <laughs> Trust me. <laughs> uh, it's like Foxhole. Like, I remember streaming Foxhole uh, on Twitch back in the day. 
well, back in the day, that sounds like a very long time ago. And people going like, oh, I'm going to stream snipe you. And I'm like, eh, you know, you have to be good to stream snipe me because generally I get myself killed before somebody. Wolf, 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 no. Get him outside, get him outside. Yeah, 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 yeah. Come on, come on, come on. I need my weapon. I don't have a weapon. Being Dutch, do you plan to build your walls into the ocean and then drain the water inside? If the game would allow me, like I'm literally living in uh, the lowest part of the Netherlands. Well, literally is a bit much, but uh, yeah, I'm in uh, the province of South Holland. So I'm, I'm in the below sea level part. Uh, I'm maybe, I mean, other people should say that, but uh, I'm not obsessed, but uh, I'm, I'm a big fan of uh, waterworks. Yes. So if any game will allow me to cosplay as an actual dodgy and drain uh, watery bits, I will definitely try. Unfortunately, I haven't seen recently any games that do a great job with water. There are doing good jobs of water. Water is very hard. Uh, like the one game that comes to mind that does a pretty damn good job with water is uh, City Skylines. Uh, where you can actually trap water like on uh, in heights and behind dikes and have it like if you break the dike like water will flow out and stuff but most have like way simpler uh, versions of water simulation like uh, for instance uh, Minecraft uh, a lot of have the sort of Minecraftian system if that makes sense as a word where uh, it just propagates from tile to tile in a sense And you can't really pump it up. Well, you sort of can, but yeah. Uh, so, yeah. It gets complicated real quick, real fast. But if I can build windmills and drain a fucking lake, I will. Yeah, Timberborn, uh, but Timberborn is doing what sort of what uh, Minecraft does as well. It does the propagation on a per tile basis. It, it's uh, it's pretty good. Like I'm I'm not uh, I'm not complaining, but it, it's not like uh, like doing bosoms. Like okay, so uh, the way uh, this is like totally not anvil anymore but uh let's suppose we have uh water here and we want to pump it out of here what you would what we would do is like we would uh dig a bosom which is literally like uh the breast sort of i mean it's the same word uh that will collect water from here then you will have a windmill here that will pump it up and then you probably have a next bosom that catches the water that you just pumped up for two meters and you put a next windmill uh, one higher and you pump it up to the third bosom and then into the overslag bosom. But generally games don't really allow you to really do that because there comes a point where the water just sort of disappears. Uh, I think Timberborn you can pump up, right? Uh, but yeah, I'll, I'll have to... Uh, I, I didn't care too much for Timberborn. I was very enthusiastic when I saw the game. And when I played it, I was like, hmm, it's okay. It didn't really grip me. But yeah, I would love, I would love for a game that would allow me to uh, drain... But yeah, like I said, I, I'm not expecting Anvil to go any any way that way. Uh, they are, uh, at least they say that the cistern and canal and aqueduct system uh, works, in a sense, uh, with uh, gravity. 
So, uh, uh, wait, where where did I die? Because I need, wait, my stuff is gone. But where did I die? I need my pickaxe back. No, I uh my my no 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 my pickaxe was done for. Uh, oh, yes, I was looking into, no, 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 I need the animal processing. Like, the question is, I think the animal processing is the one that does letter, right? They told me 21, but that was wrong, so I'd say at least, at, at least when I did it, it was at least 30. But I, again, I might have some throwing issues, so. Oh, we have spears, okay. Wait, hold on. Uh, so outside town, if I hold down the left alt, it shows me the things immediately. If I do that in or very close to the town, it seems to have like a... A uh, delay. Uh, pickaxe, 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 pickaxe. Go find a pickaxe. It's a lot of letter. I think we need more space. Uh, no, so, okay, so the, the spawning system is uh, a bit different. Uh, so whenever you die, you get a hit to your hunger, health, and stamina. Uh, that means that every time you respawn, you basically spawn with a, a very low health and hunger bar, which means that if you keep constantly uh, respawning, you constantly have to eat to bring up your hunger and health meter. Uh, but you cannot eat constantly the same food. So uh, like you can see right now, I, I just recently ate berries. Um, so I can't eat berries right now. So I can't even uh, bring up my uh, hunger meter. Now, there is a spawning resource like in Foxhole, but that goes for other towns. So if I check, uh, I don't think any of the towns has it. But the icon here on the end is, uh, suppose Iron Bridge is under attack. There will be uh, an allied settlement is under attack, and then I can spawn there by clicking there. And if this would have like 20... Uh, if I spawn there, there's just 19. And I will lose all my kit, so I can kit myself out and spawn there, but that doesn't bring the kit over, so you shouldn't do that. Uh, and you need to have a... Uh, wait. 
right, which one is it? I always forget. There is a special building that you need to put food in and that will give you the uh, shirt, in a sense. Make sense? Makes sense, I think. I hope. Uh... So, uh, yeah, if, if you don't build that structure and you don't put food in it, that means that people can't come to your rescue if you're being attacked. But you can also not, as far as I know, you cannot, like, make it massive. You can't have, like, 2,000 uh, militia. Uh, so, yeah, uh, it's, it, it's an interesting system. It is Foxhole adjacent, but not fully Foxhole, if that makes sense. I mean, it, it's not really, I, I don't think people are really surprised that it is Foxhole like adjacent, whatever we want to call it, right? Yeah, so in, uh, okay, so the, the whole, uh, the whole idea with fortresses and, like, making fortresses and stuff like that is, uh, like, even if you're getting sieged, you, you need to be sure that you have enough food in your town because, you know, you can't go out anymore. Uh... Uh, what did I want to say? Uh, so, Crow Hill. Okay, Crow Hill. That's... Uh, ah, okay. To the south something. Oh, we're already... Okay, we're uh, stretching out. Okay, good, 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 good. Uh, what was... I, I lost my train of thought. Oh, yeah. So, in... Um, so, you don't... Like, if you die... You spawn in your own... If you uh, respawn, you spawn in your own town. You spawn in your own town and uh, you spawn on your house. The house where you basically... Uh, that you use as a... Hello, gentlemen. You can, however, in your fort, uh, make uh, beds that you can use as your spawn point. So that is a separate spawn point to your house, and you can use that. Uh, wait, where am I? I'm going totally the wrong way. I am stupid. I'm stupid. Ah. <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, I'm an idiot. Uh, so if you want to, like, you, you want to build your castle or your fort or whatever you want to call it, you, you want to build it in a way that uh, you have your spawn beds, right? And next to your spawn beds, you will presumably uh, have a, a larder, if it's called. It's like a, a cabinet that you can store uh, prepared food. So prepared food is hard to store. It's not easy. It doesn't fit everywhere. Uh, but you can do in a larder. So when you're getting seized and you're fighting on the battlements, you die, you respawn inside your keep on your bed, not on your house, because otherwise you would be dead, probably. And then you can eat to restore your hunger, stamina, and health. So you, you really need to think. It's it's not like uh, in Foxhole, you basically, like, you know, you respawn in a bunker base and that's it. And, you know, you can use that as the inventory. Um... But yeah, it's it's a bit more. Uh, there's a bit more to it. It's interesting, to say the least. It's uh, it's hard to explain it with words. It's better to show, but then I have to go to uh, Blood Castle, I think it's called, to do that. I think they. Oh, but I'm not sure if they are uh, actually building one right now, like that. I mean, it was the plan to make a uh, mountain castle. 
and I just went and made the other town, so we had the iron spawn. That's like actually the only reason I'm there. Hello, um, good people of no, Crow Town. Hello. I'm here for the bricks. Uh, I, I, I have to disappoint you, good man. You can only carry nine uh, bricks. What, what yeah, that's fine. Uh, I'll oh, I come I back picked. for a second. No, one. It's not your mind. Uh, come over with me. I don't think so medieval is here at the moment. I just saw so, did you already bricks. retrieve the uh, stone bricks for him? Yeah, I'm, I'm looking for them now. They were in here. Oh, I got three. I'm sorry, one sec. I bet. <laughs> Maybe somebody just used them for another project. I mean, take this. Wait, what happened? Did we use take it? Take this one in the stockpile and run back, and by the time you come back, we should have nine more. Yeah, sure. Uh, we can do that. Yeah, that's fine. I got, I got three yeah. on me. You, you have to yeah. run twice anyway. That's fine. Yeah, that works as well. Okay. Uh, I'll be back I'll... later. Uh, thanks for now, boys. Much appreciated. Too. Okay, Roger. No problem. So this is how we do it, right? You you start to uh, help each other. You don't necessarily rely on karma. Like if they would have said no. Like, the beauty is I just put it in Alliance chat, which is basically a uh, faction chat, right? And he responded, Sir Medieval responded directly, like, yo, you can get 10 stone bricks. So uh, I like that. That's that's good. This, as far as I'm concerned, this is how it should be. Like, there, there shouldn't be, like, all the trappings of, like, oh, but y you got, like, 20 iron ore, so I want at least 10 stones. I mean, I... I do think that's where we're heading because that will like full on trade. But do, wait, this is basically how I do it in Foxhole, right? If I see somebody dig a trench, I'll just, you know, be silent, grab a shovel and help them dig. And I'm not going like, oh, I helped you dig like last night. So now you have to help me, I don't know, uh, do repairs on my bunker base or whatever. Like that's, that's not who I am personally. And I'm always sort of like, uh, you know, if, if people uh, remember that I helped them and they help me because of that, that's fine. Uh, if they don't, that's fine as well. Like, I'll find another way to get it. I mean, probably not as easy as I did the other stuff, but sure, it's, uh, it's fine. I, I can live with that. Uh, all right, let's not get myself killed now. Frick, come on. Don't be stupid. Or not more stupid than you usually are is probably the thing I want to say. All right. Uh, I need a B. There we go. Uh, I need D. Which one is it? Which one is it? Who are you? Is it you? There we go. Probably need a hammer for this. Let me go there. Let's see. It's going to be hammer, isn't it? 20 planks, 10 stone bricks. Yeah, I need a hammer. Okay. Do we still have a hammer somewhere? We have wood blanks. Yeah, he thought that uh, wood blanks were planks, I presume. Uh, oh, we're making spears by the bucket load. Hammer is three planks, two, and one. Okay. One, two, three. Oh, uh, no, I need. Uh, I don't think we have fiber. Crap. Just tell me there's fiber in here. Shit, 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 shit. Um, do we still have some fiber around? No. Crap, crap, crap. Or a hammer. Hammer is fine. Oh, there we go. Hammer. Uh, there we go. Uh, 
Oh, I had planks on me as well. Oh, we're done. We're done. Uh, so we go in. I'll put the uh, sticks in the thing. Bob. And put the hammer in my house. But, yeah, there we go. I mean, it feels very egotistical, but uh, it is what it is. Can I get, uh, can I put a storage bin over there on the north end? Yeah, sure. No, feel free to uh, put stuff down, man. Don't don't wait for me. It's fine. If it really is in the way, I can, uh, unless it's a house, I can always blow it up because I'm the founder, so that's not an issue. Like, it's, uh, okay, so this is one of the uh, other issues. Like, this is the other, the receiving end of uh, what we talked about earlier, right? Like, uh, people are also not terrified, but also, like, I don't want to make mistakes because they do understand that things are, could be delicate, right? So, like, he's holding back and not building things because, you know, he's he's afraid, maybe, I don't know, but, like, you know, he's he's asking permission, which is good. But the downside is, like, if I wouldn't respond or, you know, I, I would have logged off without telling them, he would be, like, just blindly running, not blindly, but running around and going, like, should I build it now or shouldn't I? Should I? Shouldn't I? It's the... It, it's the kind of mistrust, distrust, a lack of confidence you get if uh, you can sort of fuck up things and you're aware of that or people will make you aware of that. So yeah, it's, um, I don't know. So I'm not sure how I feel about it. Like I, I try to be uh, every test so far. I've always tried to be like people who are in the same town as me where I am the founder. Basically do what you want. It's a test. We're testing things. I'll I'll try to like you know if if I need you to do something or you know I I wish that we would do something else. I try to talk to you. Hello. But yeah, it's it's always hard. Like I, I try to do the same thing in in, in Foxhole and in our. Like I don't want to hamper other people in their fun of play too much. Like, parts of the game are that you I don't know you attack each other or whatever. That's that's fine as well. Wolf, wolf, wolf. Dude, you pick. Why you didn't pick up your spear? I didn't see it, bro. I didn't see it. It's here. It's here. You have to keep the truck. Okay. Have this. Take this. You this. can. Uh, you can look at that with the speeds as well. Wolf, 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 wolf. Oh, you got him. Okay. Careful, careful. Rusty did more damage to me than the wolf. <laughs> yes, he did. Uh, Freak, come with me. I give you a weapon for the way. Also, totally not distracting you from the fact that we have not uh, got the stone. <laughs> it's fine, it's fine. Yeah, I'm, uh, I don't know. It felt like, I don't know. Uh, pick the axe. It's a fine relic weapon that uh, defends you on the way back. Thank you kindly. 
And the bricks, uh, do I just wait for a bit or how are things here? You can wait for a bit. I mean, like. Yeah, I'm figuring out like who's gathering. I'm so sorry. I just, well, I just sent okay. the message. I have time. It's not that I'm like pressed for time. Hey, let me see. I'll go get it myself. Um, I'll, I'll be back in like um, about 15 minutes, Matt. Uh, but I'll bring I'll bring him right here into a cart. Or yeah. If, right, if you if you if you need to come back, I'll I'll have him ready for yeah, you. Yeah. I'll time just you get back. Uh, I'll just go back to my town and uh, be back in uh, 15 minutes. Yeah. That's that's fine. Yeah. Okay. All right. Thank Roger. you. Uh, now I feel like I'm in positioning them. That's rather weird. Anyway. Uh, but yeah, I'm uh, basically streaming on YouTube now. Yeah, uh, Twitch. I mean, I I still have Twitch. I'm still officially affiliated. Uh, I streamed recently, semi recently, but I don't know. I don't know. I like YouTube uh, as well. I'm uh, yeah. I'm not entirely sure, but yeah, it's um. Uh, as a platform for the most part for streaming i like twitch better uh just as a platform overall i like youtube better i like twitch always sort of statey i don't know it never really got polished seems easier to handle with better outreach i'm not sure about like i mean uh, let's let's put it in perspective right my uh my youtube channel in a in a sense is uh, more popular than my twitch channel it, and uh wasn't in the very beginning but once i started doing the uh Foxhole tutorials uh that just became the thing which makes sense because you know people uh can look back your tutorials and you know tutorials are uh bringing in traffic always like not necessarily high amounts of traffic, but they always will bring in uh, traffic. So at a certain point, it just made more sense to just uh, like I don't want to stream like every day or every other day or something like that. Uh, I like streaming the anvil tests. It's easy. I don't necessarily have to edit. I can just put on. Uh, I'll just stream on stream on YouTube, uh, and you know people can watch the vault. I'll usually not always we'll dive in and uh, make uh chapters so it's a bit easier to see things and you know that's it but yeah I, just having the base uh youtube as a base feels i don't know feels better i don't know i i, I always i don't know twitch always felt like in terms of interaction twitch is just people know twitch as an interactive platform and youtube is a bit less so Uh, so in that sense, I occasionally miss Twitch. Like, I like the interactiveness of Twitch. Like, there's more banter and more back and forth and more talking. Uh, on the other hand, it's it's a lot chiller to just stream on uh, YouTube. Uh, just, you know what? We'll blow that up. We'll blow that up. And we do. The tool maker. Am I saying that correctly? Yes, uh, blacksmith. Blacksmith is where you can make a flint pickaxe. Yeah, unfortunately. Yeah, so you can't, yeah. Uh, so if you're unpledged somewhere, it's hard to get, you need somebody else to make you a pickaxe, basically. Uh, I just brought a bunch of new branches, so you should have twigs uh, galore for now. Cool, cool, cool. Um, food. Do we have food? 
We have berry res preserves, but nothing else. Okay, let's see if I can find some... Wait, did I see boar somewhere? No, bear, boar. B-O-A... No, not really. Huh. Like, boar is good, because that's... Uh, I, I can get some rabbits. Or chickens. That's food as well. Uh, we really need to finish these, because... Uh, 15 minutes. When did I say 15 minutes? Five minutes ago, roughly. Uh, so for the playtest, yes. So uh, the way they do it right now is still uh, the weekend before a test and test uh, right now or like every other two weeks the weekend before that they will open the sign up for the pre-alpha test it will be open for 48 days so last weekend it was open from saturday uh, was open on saturday and sunday uh you can sign up all you need to do for that is just click the uh apply for pre-alpha thing button on the steam page but that just only appears the weekend before a test then you come into a big pool and from that pool they basically do a lottery and pull like i don't know like 50 or 100 or 20 i don't know i don't know the number uh they uh pull a bunch of names and those names get to um get access to the um uh to the test make sense i think that makes sense hope that makes sense mm, I, I can break the wall and the mo Uh, wait, sorry, what were you saying, Hebrim? I wasn't paying attention. Excuse me. I mean, uh, I can't de destroy the, bo the wall. Uh, let me see if I can vote you in as Thane, then you should be able to. Uh, can you vote for yourself as well, Hebrim? Uh, wait, where is Hebrim? Where is my Hebrim? You're welcome. Mm, uh, no permission. Uh, no, I, uh, I voted for you. If you go to the town hall and you click behind your own name, you might be able to get yourself to be Thane. Uh, if that doesn't work, oh, I'll just okay. uh, blow it up. Because I already voted for you. Uh, does that work? Uh, behind your name. Yeah, there you go. You're now Thane. You should be able to uh, blow up all the buildings except houses. I just uh, want to expand. You can leave, uh, it, ah, I mean, perfect. in essence, there's not necessarily something wrong with having, like, a uh, double wall. So if somebody runs in with a wolf on their tail, having a double wall can be helpful. But for now, I do agree, just uh, get rid of this wall, that's fine. I mean, uh, when the PvP will be on, then yeah, yeah, I guess. Yeah, exactly, yeah, that's that's my reason, basically, yeah. Plan to Starfield or anything to do with it. Uh, I, I'm i trying very hardly, Bob, to uh, contain my hype for, um, for Starfield. I've been burned with Fallout 76. Uh, Bethesda is a company that has a good marketing department. They know how to sell their game. Uh, it looks right up my alley uh but fallout 76 well not fully but kind of looked up my alley as well and turned out to not be so uh what's the word like uh there is a nice saying like uh i don't know burnt once whatever uh you know they don't get me that easily again 
No, it looks good, and everybody, like, a, a lot of people are sort of up in arms about uh, the 30 FPS. I don't mind. I don't care about FPS. Not really. Like, if it's... Uh, when things aren't stuttery, I'm happy. Like, I've never checked whether a game is running on 120 or 60 or whatever. Yeah, no, it was for... I mean, if it is for console, it's... I mean, I have a, uh, a GeForce uh, GTX 3060, so it's not going to run. Uh... Oh, you guys finished the planks already. Yeah, I'm uh, I'm bringing the bricks in a bit because uh, the other town needed some time to uh, arrange the bricks for me. So I'll be getting them to that. So what I'm trying to say is if uh, consoles are uh, capped at 30 FPS, uh, unless you have like a very, very good uh, PC, chances are I'd argue that your, um, your PC isn't... I mean, it's going to run it. I'm not going to say that it won't run. I'm just saying that it might not be as great at running as great as you'd hoped. Maybe, but we'll see. We'll see. It's uh, it, it looks good. Like I said, it looks looks interesting. I'll take the bearded axe. I don't need feathers. I don't know where do we put feathers. Uh, Corsal, your food is ready. Your uh, small game rabbit. Oh, yeah. All right, and then berries go. But yeah, it, it it looks cool, but that doesn't mean much now, does it? Like that's all marketing. That's uh, hype building, and rightfully so. I think. I think. Uh, I, I think they can't really afford to really fuck this up, so they can't make it a cyberpunk twenty seventy uh, twenty seventy seven at first launch. Uh, I don't think it necessarily has to be a game of the year contender right away. Me thinks personally, it just needs to be good, not outrageously great or anything. But I, yeah, I think it needs. And yeah, now we can uh, cut the stone. Oh, but that's not necessary. I get a full... Well, I mean, if you have uh, stone uh, fragments, that's fine. But I get full-on bricks from uh, uh, Crow Town, whatever they're called. Crow thing. Oh, I see. I see. Because I, in a sense, I sort of traded uh, iron for bricks. Well, I said you guys can use our iron. That's fine. Uh, if I need stuff, just uh, remember that I said you can use our iron. So, yeah. That's the one, Tricky <laughs> Cruncher. No, but I mean, it's it's the basics of, uh, you know, being in the same faction, right? Help each other. No fucking around. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know, I know. So, uh, we'll go get that. There we go. That's the one, yes. Um, That's the button to press. There we go. So, yeah, it's, um, it, it's looking good. I'll say that, but it also really, really like, 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 not joking, but it looks like they ripped off uh, No Man's Sky for at least 60%. Like the scanning for uh, landmarks, the scanning for animals, the scanning for minerals on planets, the uh, planetary systems type deal thingy. Uh, really, really, really reminds me of No Man's Sky. Like, really. Uh, sure, there will be, like, the, uh, story element, uh, that I hope will be good and not too, um... I mean, story-wise, I, I don't know. Fallout 4 didn't have the greatest story. It wasn't bad, but it wasn't, also wasn't great. Feel 
but if it's enough to like keep me interested and especially side missions uh tend to be kind of okay because they're a bit more confined so uh we'll see like i said it looks cool the uh starship system where you build your own starship I mean, it looks cool the way they showed it. Uh, if it actually is going to be good, I have no clue. I mean, I hope so, but... I mean, that could basically be an, a, a big dot, right? Um, so yeah, we'll see, and the, uh... J'arrive. I have arrived. Okay. So yeah, it's easy to make that look cool, but it could also be kind of meaningless. Like uh, the upgrading in um, Cyberpunk, like where you upgrade your weapons, like to have like plus three damage, you know. What's up? How many more did you need? Uh, so, uh, I took four, so I need six right now. Roger, roger, wait one second. Oh yeah, yeah. Oh, you cool. I didn't, wasn't sure if you'd be able to access that. Okay, cool. Oh wait, hold on. Uh, Thanks you so have much for letting us use Iron Man. Too many items recently. You can't retrieve more. That's that's new. That's interesting. I'll take seven to be sure. Right. Yeah, you can't, uh, if you're not pledged, you can't just uh, indiscriminately retrieve. You have to wait a bit, which is cool. That's good against griefing. I mean. Thanks, people. Love you. Bye. Thanks, Freak. See ya. I need a wavy mode. I love the Foxhall wavy mode, but that doesn't work here. Oh, that'd be so freaking. That would be good. Or a salute or something. Anyhow. Have a good for one. For sure, for sure. You too, man. <clears throat> it really, really, like, two or three emotes is all we need. Like, that would make, uh, like, a pointing emote, a wave emote, and a salute emote. I think that, or any, maybe, like, a very medieval bow. Or whatever it's called, uh, there is probably a very good uh, word for that. Like that would go a very long way in counteracting the fact that people don't necessarily all speak the same language or speak or read at all, right? Like just wave, okay? Clear. He's just saying hi. Uh, pointing, they probably want you to do something somewhere where they're pointing, right? And the salute or whatever, the, the thank you thing, just, you know, since we can't comment and people don't always hear the thank you, it's just very simple. Very simple. It's very simple. There we go. Uh, I'll be bringing this in and then I'm uh, calling it a day because uh, I can feel my finger joints uh, not liking the heat plus the amount of time I'm behind the PC. Uh, then I have to do an analysis, by the way, of my CPU uh, temps because... Mm, what I can see right now, it only peaked at 91, which is okay. I think the the CPU only gets throttled at 90 f over 90, but I'm not sure. I'll have to dive into that. Oh, yeah. Uh, hello, people. I come bearing gifts. Uh, I need a hammer, so we put the cabbage seed in here. I'll grab the hammer. I'll finish the. The hammer, <laughs> not the broad axe. Come on. Ooh. 
Yes, it's finished. We can do our letter. We can do our letter. Yay. Uh, if you want to turn it into letter, you can just left click and that will submit it into the uh, animal processing and make it into letter. Same goes for uh, oh, thank you. Uh, same goes for logs in the lumber camp. If you just left click, it will automatically turn that log into plank, so you don't have to choose. You can just walk up to the lumber camp, left click, and have planks. If you need sticks, you have to go through the menu. Appreciate that. Thank you. Both. As far as I know, both were. All right. Uh, so I'll finish the uh, letter and then I'm probably off. Like I said, my... Uh Wait, who are we talking about? Which, wait, what, what is his name? What's his name? Okay. Yeah, 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 never mind. Okay. Then I don't know.
All right. Uh, yeah. Do I do have? Uh, I have one brick still. Can I put that somewhere where they can use it? I can't. Oh, I can put it in the. There we go. Yeah. Like, I don't, I, I don't mind like other people. I'm, I'm gonna hop off so it's fine if other people use it, right? Uh, Hebram, I'm gonna hop off, uh, for today. So, uh, feel free to do with the town, whatever, man. It's fine. I'll be back tomorrow and I'll see uh, how things look. Yeah, I have the same issue. I start working at. In five hours, I need to sleep. <laughs> yeah, that is a good point. Uh, but yeah, so, I mean, if you want to go through or not, uh, it's it's all fine. Cheers, see you tomorrow. Yeah, see you tomorrow, man. And uh, uh, may your workday be uh, short and uneventful. <laughs> uh, Corsal, uh, me and Hebram, uh, at least I am going to hop off right now. Hebram, I think, as well, so... Uh... Basically, for now, the town is yours, I think. Wait, oh, yeah, just make gather. You, uh, wait, can we make you Thane? If we now vote for uh, Corsal, that makes it easy for him. Then he, yeah. So if you want to, this gives you the power to blow up stuff if you don't like the placement of it. Uh, and we'll both be back tomorrow. All right. Okay, thanks very much. Bye. Uh, Cheers, yes, Quinn. Uh, and I'm off. Uh, so you 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 uh, catch me uh, catch me right at the end. But yes, uh, neue, neue Brille, Dienstbrille, as uh, Arma tells it. Right. Uh, I dropped everything. Uh, thank you, everyone. Uh, we'll be back tomorrow. Or I know you know if you're watching this back, you can just click right now. Schlaf gut. Danke. Dankeschön. Dankeschön. Uh, yeah. Gute Nacht. Have a good one, everyone. Good night. Bye-bye.